Anyway, hello everyone, how's it going? Welcome back to the magical land of Final Fantasy X. So, uh, last time we got the airship and did all sorts of things. Now we're back in this magical forest of death. We're going to explore up the, uh, the crystally path of doom. I'm going to see what's going on up there. Also, I think maybe we can do the butterfly thing now, I'm not entirely sure. Let's go over here, uh, we're getting very, very close to the Uggers. With, with Lulu. Good old Lulu. Anyway, hello everyone, chat. Hello, German. Did German show up briefly? I think German showed up briefly. If you are still here, hello, German. What up? AKA Robin. Pro streamer, indeed. What up, Simon? Hooray! The really good... All badly lip-synced game is being streamed. Oh, you didn't say both, you said... But badly. That's still, that's still not a word. Try again! Wait a minute, move that off the screen. Alright, so let's go look up this uh, crystal path. I've no idea what's going on up here. But uh, I'm sure something magical. Anyway, yeah, so if you see any frame drops or anything like that, I am recording... Uh, basically, I'm trying to record this with Bandicam, which is a thing I haven't used in years. Uh, so that we get a 1080p version for YouTube specifically, which will obviously take a little longer for me to upload, but, you know, I'm doing it like every two days anyway. Uh, it's easy to get to Magalania Temple now that this road's open again. Oh, is that all you have to say? Well, isn't that fascinating? Thank you for sharing that. Thank you, darling. Alright. Oh, uh, I have no idea what we're doing. I've abs- I, I, like, I vaguely sort of remember this crystally road, but I don't remember what the point of it is or where it takes you or anything. I guess to Magalania. I suppose. I mean, she's just acting like this is perfectly normal. Yeah, I saw you hiding out behind there, you sneak. Alright, we upgraded our rank in Albedian. There's a butterfly there. Can I touch the butterfly? I want to touch the butterfly! He ran away. What a piece of shit. Alright, let's save that. Lovely. So anyway, how are you all doing, chat? Hello, Alex, the man. Emperor Pigeon. Simon. Etc, etc. Uh, where's the path that we came down? This one, right? No. Where the hell did we... Where do we go? This is where we fought, um, was it Spheromorph, I think? Pretty sure it's where we fought the boss? Maybe? I'm lost. I'm, I'm gonna be honest with you, I'm completely fucking lost. No, so we're not getting battles, that's kind of strange. Well, well there, game. Well, don't be doing that. Uh, what part of the game have you got to? Um, good question. I think it's the Calm Lands we have to go to next, is that what it's called? I think it's called the Calm Lands, right? The big, massive open area where it has the, um... The arena very near it. Uh, where's the path? Is it this way? Is it, was that not where I just went? Wait, what? I thought... I thought this is where I just... You know what? We're back here. The Calm Lands, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what I said, right? I think so. Yeah, I think that's where we have to go next for the story. I'm not entirely sure. Did you get your Jimbo? Not yet. We do not have your Jimbo. And we do not have, uh... The other two. Wink, wink. The two final ones. She's blocking the... Really, bitch? Fucking really? Yeah, do you want to join my Blitzball team? She doesn't. God. Jason be my hero, baby69. I will. That's a creepy name, but hello. I appreciate the creepiness. I remember when Jason put up FF music during Subnautica. <laughs> yeah, calm me down a little bit. Hello. Oh, that's right. Your father's missing. I remember. Let's go find the father. He's probably back here, right? He's probably just like... On the ground, ten feet away, clutching his dude. I remember watching um, I remember watching a Black Mirror episode, and I'm gonna kind of spoil the episode for you, but I don't remember the name of the episode, so you know, bear that in mind. Oh, this is the Thunder Plains. Interesting. But yeah, basically, the premise of this uh, twist at the end of the episode was that essentially he's dead. You killed him. Sweet. Jason is now hosting me. Thank you so much for the host, Jason. How are you? A uh, lot of Jasons today. A little odd. Um, anyway. The premise of this episode, the twist at the end, was basically that this little girl's, like, grandfather or something was looking after her. And he went off, like, into the snow or something. And they were in, like, a little cabin. And then she goes... <laughs> they do this dramatic thing at the end where she goes to go find him, right? Because she's a little girl. She can't look after herself. She, she's gonna go find him. She goes... She go <laughs> and then they do this dramatic cut, right? To, like, where she's frozen to death in the snow. And, you know, that's really sad and all. But it was so fucking funny, because I shit you not, they cut to her like 10 feet down the path of her house, frozen to death in the snow. I was like, bitch didn't get far, did she? <laughs> hey, did you hear? A saying that was a Ryan Bavel. What's that? Oh, that was me. Everything was me. I'm the main character. I do bad things. Uh, what's going on here? This is where we had water sex with the Yuna, I think. Something like that. Where's the butterfly thing? Because it was around here, right? 
Father Rikidi was a guard. Oh, is that, um... Luzu? Is that his name? Was it Luzu? Maybe it was Luzu. My bad, Jason. Got my password and thought this would be funny. It is funny. It's, it's kind of creepy, but I'm okay with it. Uh, so what's your what's your normal name? Let me let me in on this. Uh, where the hell are we? Oh wait, we're supposed to be going that way. Let's not go that way. I'm trying to figure out how to get back to um uh the place with the butterflies. That's what I'm trying to find. Who the hell are you, sir? Supposed to meet my family here, but they're nowhere in sight. Dude, they're ten feet away. Stop it! <laughs> Hope you find them, bitch. They're over there. What? Really? Thanks, kid. I thought it was like Luzu was the father or something. That would have been pretty cool. Uh, I did it, I think. Oh, wait, no, this is not them. Okay, so they're farther away than 10 feet, but not by much. Not by much. Uh, they're over here, right? <laughs> you didn't look very far, did you? Fucking hell. You're welcome. I was reading out with my wife, thanks to all of you. I finally met up with my husband, thanks to your help. I can't thank you enough. You could try. Yeah, you know, you could try. You haven't. Where's your child? You've, have you lost them now? <laughs> like, God, you people. You didn't give me anything. What a bitch. And yeah, you do miss the water sex. I know. It's disappointing. Uh, so how do we get back to butterfly section? Can we go through here? We can. No, we can't. That's right. He said the rose colors. I remember. Hmm. I don't really get back to butterfly city. But you know, I can't. Never mind. Isn't it just, um... Is it over by the family and then we just go south? I think it's like... Actually, maybe we need to go. You know what? It's around here somewhere either way. We either have to go like up the normal path, not the crystal one, or down here. Let's try going down here first. Though. Let's just have a look. See what's going on with this. Shit. Hello, butterflies. No, that's right. That was the thunder planes. Can you tell my sense of direction is fucking shocking? Yes, yes, it is. This is how bad my memory is as well. I completely forgot that we even tried to go down there. Sorry, it's this way then. It is the only way we haven't been. It has to be this way. Yeah, 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 yeah. All right, this makes a lot more sense. I'm not seeing. Do we get battles here, but not in the other section? That's weird. That's weird, and I'm not okay with it. I'm not okay with it. Mari, kill him. That's my boy. All right, let's get Lulu up in this bitch. Well then, what up in this hizzy. Well then, what next one? Well, maybe you could just like shoot some fire at this thing. Wait a minute. Your water. Damn, I screwed that one up. Get healed, son. Bum, 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 bum. Yeah, I'll turn the battles off when we get there. Don't worry. Yo, can can Lulu have a go though, please? Lulu, can you? Can I, thank you. Hey, Thunderer! Butterflies north plus the family. Yeah. We got there in the end. Takes me a while, but I get there in the end. Alright. Yeah, we gotta turn the bounce off now, actually. <laughs> I mean, we don't even really need to fight the things around here. They're not very strong, so they're not really gonna love us up all that much. You know, not that much XP. Then why waste our time? That's what I say. So I can't remember which butterfly. Oh, we have to talk to that dude again, probably. Unless I can just, like, touch this thing. No, no, I cannot. But alas. Alright, let's speed up. Whee! I touched a butterfly! No! No! I can't remember which direction we're going for the challenge. I think it's this way. Okay. 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 Run. Accidentally start the challenge. Don't worry, we got this shit. Come to me, and you'll see. Wait, no, that's the wrong lyrics, and also, uh, I'm confused. Where's the... I, s I still swear there's one... No! I still swear there's one under the bridge. I don't ever want to be... You see what I mean about the time limit? Look how tight it is now. Like a virgin up in here. Like a goddamn vir... I did it! God, I'm good! Alright, hang on. Go touch this bitch. What do we get? Mega relics. That's not what I wanted! That's not what I wanted! Oh, god damn it. There's gonna be something on it. You start replaying this, haven't since you were 10 years old. Yeah, it's been about a decade for me as well. Legitimately. Like, I, I know the game's only about 12 years old. I played it to death for the first couple of years after it came out. You know, two, year, two years is a long time to replay the same game, you know? Unless you're a, a Dark Souls fan, because they're still replaying that game, and that game's seven fucking years old. That's <laughs> seven and a half almost. Um. But yeah, uh, again, it's been, it, I think the game's been out about 12 years, so, you know, give or take, it's been maybe like 9 years or something, but it's been a, the better part of a decade, if not a decade, since I played it. Uh, so there you go. Is this the one we touch? Touch it! Touch it! Touch it! Alright, it's not that one. Hmm, fair enough. Maybe we have to do it in this section, uh, to get the, 
the sigil or the crest or whatever it is that we're, we're looking for. Test your chest, love this, can't stand the heat, get out of the wild, wild west. Know what I'm saying? You know exactly what I'm saying. Isn't it this one we have to touch? I think it's this one. Yeah, yeah, it's that this one. That's the one right here. Yeah. Wait, you're red. Yeah, I was going to say, you're bloody red. You mean bloody red? Oh, yeah, these things are really strong. Well, I say really strong. They're not going to be for us anymore. I mean, actually, that was a crit hit, and that didn't do that much. He also critted. You know what? If you want to crit every time, I'm fine with that. Uh, what do we got here? A cup of haters. It's weekend's ice. I will blizzard eye you, you bitch. Oh, yeah, so, um, the reason I'm awake a bit earlier today is, uh, I had a nightmare, right? And I swear to you, I haven't had a nightmare in... Are you 1 EXP from leveling up? You slut. Um, I haven't had a nightmare in uh, uh, many years. Maybe not, like, a decade. <laughs> like, you know, since playing this game. But, many years. And this was a fucking weird nightmare. You were serious? Yeah, I was, I was serious. I had a nightmare. Um... So what happened was, right, I had, like, a delivery to my house, like, a food delivery. And they handed me this, like, bag or something, right? And I specific like, this bag was, like, fucking flat. There was basically nothing in it. And I said to the dude, wait a minute, this is not everything I ordered. Because apparently I dream about ordering food, you know? I'm a simple man, I like food. Um, I said, this isn't everything I ordered. And then, he fucking sprinted at full speed to his getaway vehicle. I shit you not, like the car started going brum, brum, like they were getting the fuck out of there. No, it doesn't bother me, like I'm not upset that I had like a, you know, it's just a nightmare, it's not the end of the world. Uh, it happens. Apparently very rarely, but it does happen. Uh, so he fucking bolted to this car that started, you know, started out going brum, brum, like a getaway vehicle. And then I think through my head, I was like, is this man just give me a bomb? So apparently someone was trying to assassinate me in my dream, and then I woke up. And I was actually, like, really fucking freaked out. Well, not, like, really freaked out, but, like, for a while after I woke up, I was like... I was like, am I, am I still asleep? I don't know, like, I had that feeling for, like, an hour after I woke up. I was like, am I, am I still dreaming? Like, it, this doesn't feel real. Please. And it was very strange. It was a very weird experience. So, uh, yeah. I had a dream about someone uh, trying to blow me up, I guess. I never actually got blown up in the dream, though, because I woke up. But, uh, yeah, it was just it was just really creepy, you know? Like, the, the how fast he fucking ran away from me. Like, this dude, Usain bolted this shit. Like, instantly. The second he gave it to me, <clears throat> off he went. And I was like, excuse me. Like, before I could even finish this, I was like, excuse me. Like, this isn't everything. And gone. And then I woke up. That was, that was the whole dream. Not exactly exciting. I've gone the wrong way, haven't I? Mother? Fuck yeah. That's the confusing thing about when you get in battles with the, uh... The, <laughs> get in battles with the butterflies. You know what I mean? Get in battles because of the butterfly. Fucking hell! I can't click on... Oh, God. Nipples. God damn... Fuck! Stop! Stop it! Stop it right now! Alright, hang on. Oh, just some of the Screw it all. Screw it all to hell. Get in pulse, son. I got an aqua breath. We already have aqua breath, sir. I'll have you know. How do you not know this? I'll have you know. Uh, my god, you've got a lot of health. My god. Ow, stop being on my bum up, man. Oh, that's Blizzard. Yeah, that's not what I meant to do. Well, it is what I meant to do, but it's, it's kind of not what I meant. You know what I'm saying? My fingers meant to do it, but my brain did not. Or was it the other way around? No, yeah, it was the fingers. I blame the fingers. Right, hang on, slow that shit down. Slow that shit right down. God, God damn it! So we got teleported back to where we touched the butterfly. So this is probably going to be the hard one. This is probably the one that I've never bloody done. Because there's a lot of butterflies. They're all a bunch of dicks. Got any fire breath? No, we got. Uh, well, we either way we have aqua breath. Whether we got it from him or not, I can't remember, but we definitely have it. Uh, well, we, that's right, we got Aqua Breath from the, uh, the Jewel Horns. Oh my god! Why? Ah! Okay, resummon Bahamut. I'm just, I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna Mega Flare them. I know that seems ridiculous, but I don't care. There we go. Mega Flare. Suck it. That was quite a bit of damage. Good, good job there, sir. Good job. Never, never, never beat it. I remember I got stuck at a part towards the end, I think. Through the mountains, don't know if that's towards the end. Hmm, mountains. 
It might have been where the Ronsos are from. I think they live in the mountains. There's a part... I think it's actually just after the Carmans, isn't it? The part with the, the Ronsos in the mountain area? Okay, I dodged the butterflies like a champ. Alright, touch that. Touch it! This motherfucking butterfly! Okay, it's fine. Fine. We're not, we're not gonna, gonna do it this run because that butterfly danced around me like, I don't know, like a really good dancer. How did I not touch that? What is the perspective on these butterflies? Like, oh my god. Alright, whatever. <laughs> whatever. Whatever. I also had, um... I, I've been apparently having a lot of dreams lately. No, touch the butterfly, Titus. Uh, I had a dream a couple of nights ago. This wasn't a nightmare. Wait, hence I called it a dream. Uh, about... It's, so, I've been watching a lot of Kitchen Nightmares recently, which is funny. Funnily enough, it's got Nightmare in the name. Um, yeah, I've been watching a lot of Kitchen Nightmares, which if you don't know, is a show with Gordon Ramsay. And, uh, apparently I dreamed that me and Gordon Ramsay were in some kind of giant, like, shopping center, like, mall-looking thing. I don't know if we were in America or what, I don't know, because I was watching the American version. I have no idea. But anyway, um, we were in that, and we were also with a guy who was, like, his assistant or something. Wait, I missed one. Okay, there's a sneaky butterfly around here somewhere. Is it under the bridge, like I, I think I mentioned that I thought there was one? Maybe. Anyway, we were with, like, his assistant or something, and weirdly enough, his assistant was called, um, John. But it wasn't Jean-Baptiste, who is actually his assistant. This was not Jean, this was a dude called John. Not, not French, just John. I don't know who the fuck this John fella was. It's there! Are you kidding me? That is the sneak... I'm so mad. I'm so mad. Okay, hopefully that's the last one. Anyway, so yeah, we were, we were walking through this, like, shopping center thing. And, um, I, again, I guess this would, like, border on a nightmare, weirdly enough, but, uh, I didn't, like, wake up screaming or anything. It didn't really bother me that much. It was just kind of strange. Uh, but at the same time, we were going through this, um, this mall-looking thing, and a bunch of the security guards were, like, they got possessed or something? Hey, we did it! Sweet. They got possessed or something? And the, um... Basically, they all started walking towards us, like, pursuing us, but trying not to draw attention to it. So that everyone in the mall didn't notice. Kind of like the Terminator scene, right? Okay, again, we got Alexias. This is not... This is not what I'm looking for, game. I'm, tr I'm not looking for Alexias. I'm trying to get this bloody Crest Sigil thing. I'm gonna have to look up how to get this, because apparently I don't remember. Uh, the bluff I touch to begin spawns one to touch right next to me. Yep, there you go. Um, yeah, anyway. So they started, like, Terminator-style slowly walking towards us, but, you know, briskly pursuing us. Butterfly, FF10, catching. Okay, um, yeah, and they were like possessed by aliens or some weird shit like that. I don't even know what happened. Alright, so the Butterfly minigame, the minigame can play three times, or whatever, the first mirror has to complete the game before you can catch the butterfly, the cameras out, the chest will appear, the first time that the chest is pissed. Delete the arrow while you can play the minigame as many times as you like, you never receive the prize once. Oh, on the mess below, the red dots represent the red butterfly. Okay, cool. Map on the left is central forest, the map on the right is the most forest. The third version is harder to complete and has more bread butterflies, so we must move away. Uh, first we complete. Okay, so. You will only receive a teleport sphere. Sphere? Sphere? Uh, for completing one of the sections. If you complete both, then you'll receive Kamari Saturn Sigil instead. Hang on a minute. Um... I'm confused. I gotta be honest, like, we've done it. It doesn't... So the guy thing, he doesn't mention anything about... Um, at least what I've opened. It doesn't mention anything about having to redo the minigame. Um, at least, it basically says you can do it once for certain prizes before Spheromorph, which is the boss. Then it specifically says you can do it again after Spheromorph. Uh, and then it says you can do it again after you get the airship. And that's when you can get the Sigil. We got the airship. Is that a blue butterfly? Okay, no it's not. God damn it. We have the airship. 
So, I'm confused why it seems to want me to do it more than once. Because again, this, this doesn't mention having to do it more than once. It just specifically says that you can do it three times. But again, we have the airship, so... Yeah, I don't know exactly what they want from me. I've got, I, I, I've got to be honest with you. Um, well, I guess we'll redo it here, see if we get a different prize. That's all I can really think to do. I don't know, but the time is extremely tight. Extremely, extremely goddamn... Touch the butterfly, Titus, man! Uh, <laughs> how far are you? Uh, you mean, like, in the overall grand scheme of the game? Maybe, like, halfway through the main story, or maybe a little bit more. Like, we're a decent chunk in. We're, we're a decent chunk. Talk to the other guy, talk to the bird thing. Uh, good, good point. We'll try that in a second. After this attempt. This quick little attempt. Oh, bloody butterfly. You basically need to hit them without missing them on the way past. But, again, the problem with this minigame is the perspective on the butterflies. It's... Maybe I just have no depth perception. I don't know. But... I can never really tell where the bloody things are. It looks like they're either behind or in front of me. Or, you know, like... You see what I mean? Like, I thought I touched that one. Apparently, I did not. So you gotta backtrack, and then when you backtrack, you waste time, and then when you waste time, you got no time to do it, and then you gotta redo it again. And it's just like, it, it's shit. I hate it. Okay, excuse me? That wasn't all of it? Alright, they turned up the gas, didn't they? We'll talk to Birdman, though. Hang on. Hello, Cassius. You have to do them both back to back. See, that's, that's why I was reading the guide to see if it mentioned anything like that. Is FFA still my favorite? I mean, yeah. Uh, I think 9 is probably the best Final Fantasy game personally, but I think I prefer 8 because the mini game, the card game in 9 is shit. So the, the triple triad card game for me pushes 8 above 9, but if we're just comparing the games without the mini games, I think 9 is better. And the butterfly that changes color attracts the red and blue butterflies. Blue, yeah, okay. Alright, same old shit. Same old shit. Same old shit. It it. Alright. So we basically gotta do this in one foul swoop. Whoop. Okay, that was not a foul swoop, but uh, as long as we don't have to like run backwards, we should be mostly fine. Yeah, it's kind Pitcher. of running backwards. Page you! I'll check that out. It was Cassius. Thank you so much, Cassius, for the resub. Uh, for eight months in a row. Very kind of you. Thank you. Thank you. Appreciate it. How are you, Cassius? Cassius Clay. Cassius Ono. Hang on a minute. Get out of the way, red butterfly. I've got seven, six seconds to glory. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. I did it. All right. Do we get? Did we got an empty bloody chest? And now it's just a butterfly. You're Roger in my bum right now. What is this? Get out of here. Get out of here. All right. I'm gonna thwack this thing. Lovely. And then I'm gonna thwack this thing. Lovely. And then I'm gonna thwack this thing. And it's not gonna die. And then we're gonna thwack it. And it'll die. Here we go. <laughs> Rawr! I'm a spooky dragon. It's very colorful. Okay then. Um. So, we got the exact same prize, which was nothing, so I am confused. So we're going to try and find a guide that doesn't suck, so uno momento por favor, because it, it, we've done it, but I don't know how we get this bloody reward. Uh, what's the sigil called? Saturn sigil, okay, so we're going to look up Saturn sigil. Saturn sigil. So want to know how we get the Saturn sigil, man. Uh, can't get the Saturn sigil. I found all seven butterflies in both games, but no chest pairs, either a teleport sphere or a satin sigil. Exactly. I've caught seven in each game, I made sure to count myself for catching seven one, all the butterflies vanished, but the time doesn't stop me. Final suggestion I was able to finally get my satin sigil tonight. Okay, who suggestion? Okay. Oh my god, this description. First, know that there are two butterfly mazes, yes. Each has three appearances. One before sphere move, one sphere morph, one after, and one after you get the airship. Okay, we've got the airship, yes. Uh, in the final appearance, the maze closest to the Macalania Travel Agency will yield a treasure chest containing a teleport sphere. The maze farthest to the travel agency will yield a treasure chest containing a teleport sphere. The maze farthest to the travel agency will yield a treasure chest containing a teleport sphere. The maze farthest to the travel agency will yield a treasure chest containing a teleport sphere. The maze farthest to the travel agency will yield a treasure from your description, you haven't completed a butterfly maze hunt yet. You have done part of one only, or possibly part of two, thinking they were in a single maze. If you do complete a single maze, be sure to get the treasure. Be careful. What? But we've done this! But... But we... But we... But we did it! Is there a third area? No, there's just two. 
Hmm. Okay, again, I'm trying to look at these guides to see if any of them are more descriptive. Chris found Mount Gagazette, the city is okay. Yeah, Mount Gagazette is uh, where you get Kamari's crest. So that's probably where you were if you were on a mountain. The was given to you after completing the butterfly, which is, again, close to where we are. Uh, butterfly Omega, yeah, okay, look. Oh, I've done the fucking butterfly hunt! I, I don't understand! We just did it! I don't get it! I'm very confused! It specifically says there's two of them. We did two of them. Like, what do you want from me? I don't understand. Game, I do not understand. Are we doing this one, I suppose? Isn't it that butterfly that we have to touch? I think it is this one. Hmm. Touch the bloody butterfly, you muppet! Are you kidding me? Can I just not touch this butterfly? I think that's a fake butterfly. It's a fake butterfly. All right. Go to the travel agency chest. Um. I guess I could. I really remember which direction the travel agency was, to be honest. I think it's the other direction, isn't it? Oh, it's this one, okay. Yep. My god. My god. <laughs> okay. We can do it, I believe. I feel like these butterflies have moved. Oh, it's because that one was sneakily hiding behind the bloody tree! Oh my god. I was like, hmm, I swear there was a butterfly there. Oh yeah, yeah there was, Jason. Yeah, yeah there was. It was fucking hiding. Cheetah. Cheetah. It's with the, like, empty chest for now. It's so weird. Such an odd mechanic. Maybe it's like... I don't know, actually. I don't know why the empty chests do that. That is legitimately so easy compared to the other one. Like, you have so much time. Hang on, 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 hang on. On the guide, it specifically said, if the timer doesn't uh, disappear immediately, then you haven't actually done it. So what we've been getting is a reward for getting most of the butterflies, not the reward for getting all of them. So there are hidden butterflies that we haven't seen. And that's what's going wrong here. So there's some we're missing. Probably only like one or something. But it is, it is making like a weird flash when I do it, as if to say I've done it. But uh, that must be that must be the case. That, must, that has to be it. That has, that has to be it. I don't understand. Okay, so let's, let's try and like use this time to search around, right? Is that a, that's a red butterfly, right? Uh, do we have to backtrack over here, perhaps? No, not at all. That leaves the... Okay. We're just checking. We're just figuring out. This is why this butterfly minigame is a pain in the ass. Hmm. It's got to be hidden, then. Like, under... Wait a minute. You don't need to click on the butterflies? You just walk into them? This is a revelation. I had no idea. I thought you had to click on them. This whole time. This whole time. Is it behind this tree, perhaps? No, doesn't seem to be. Hmm. But it's like, again, it's specifically making a flash when we get what is seemingly the last one. Like, watch when we touch this, it will flash. Yeah, that must mean we're done. Like, I can't see any anywhere. But again, the chest is empty. What? I don't understand. I just want the sigil, man. Oh my god. Okay. Oh, the crest. Sorry. It's a crest. Oh my god. Okay, so, hang on. What did we get from these? Did we get the Omega Alexis and then the Alexis? We did, right? We did. I'm pretty damn sure we did. Therefore, therefore, I come to conclude, uh, because, again, if you recall, it specifically says you can do this three times. One before Sveromorph, one afterwards, and one after you get the airship. Now, here's the thing. We have the airship, however... It lists the rewards as the, you know, the after Spheromorph version as being the Mega Alexias and the Alexias. In the area with the Harp Man, there is a butterfly north of the one you touch at the start. 
I mean, that may be. But that doesn't change the fact that it, the, the screen is still flashing as if to say we've done it. I really didn't actually mean to touch these butterflies. That is irritating. Yeah, um... Anyway. The point is, the rewards we got from that seem to suggest that this is counting as not us not having the airship, basically. If that's the case, then we have to come back here later. Even later to get it. This area you are in now. Uh, are we sure about it? I don't know about that one. Yeah, I've avoided most of them, lovely. This Birdman's over here. It is maybe after you can go anywhere you want in the airship. Yeah, exactly, that's what I'm thinking. We do have the airship, however, we are still not able to control it yet. So, that must mean what it, that must be what it means. Uh, again, very, a little indescriptive there, you know, like, after you've got the airship, well, I have the airship. But again, we are, we are still on a, a rather linear path at the moment, so... We have to wait until we can fly back here, basically, is the, the better way of describing it. So when we can fly back here, we'll be able to do this again. Again, both times, and we'll get uh, an even tighter time limit. I think they shave like 5 or 10 seconds off, something ridiculous like that. So that's going to be a giant pain in the ass. But either way, uh, where the hell am I? Good question, where am I? Either way, uh, let's go back to where we should be going, uh, which I think was... I think we still had to go this way. And then through here. And then and then this way. Yeah, okay. Alright, cool. Let's just carry on with the story for now. Because uh, again, we seem to have to fly back here later and do it later. I wish they were clearer about that, but hey, at least we figured... You know, it's not like we did it for nothing. We got the the Alexia and the Mega Alexia. I mean, we ended up doing it like twice each. But, uh, you know, we could have spent a lot more time there. Hey, it's the Calmlands. This area is friggin' huge. It's basically like Hyrule Field. Calmlands. Long ago, the High Summoners fought Sin here. The road ends here. Law. Beyond, there are no towns, no villages, only endless plains. Many Summoners stray from their path and lose their way here. thinks this music doesn't seem quite right. It feels weirdly out of place considering all the music so far has been pretty spot on. This music just doesn't seem quite right. I've always known where to go. I I won't let you die. I'll find a way somehow. Yeah, Lulu talking about paths. Like, I couldn't follow one if I tried. Have you seen me? Go around in circles. Like, what I mean about this music is this particular track sounds like it's from, like, Final Fantasy IV or something. Like, you could imagine it being one I of the, like, retro you, ones. I would find a way. It sounds sort of a bit chibi. Not chibi necessarily, but sort of... I wanted to believe that words could make it come true. You know, like Super Nintendo music. Like, it's not bad at all, but... It just doesn't seem quite right for this soundtrack. Is this the rearranged version? No. It just, it just, doesn't, it just doesn't sound quite right. Very odd. God damn it! Alright, hang on. Oh, look, the dog's all, like, purple eyes and, and fluffy white gray hair. Uh, yo, hang on, I'm trying to highlight the dog. There we go. That was confusing. Resistance to magic? Watch out for sleep! <laughs> Never. I'm gonna thwack it with a stick. Take the... I mean, alright, you can just evade me. Yeah, just evade everything I do, you you little bitch. Uh, who's... Are you weak against ice? Really? Really now? Yay, yeah, new reskin enemies. Yeah, I know. Like I say, this is this is genuinely my biggest complaint with this game. It's like, I think this game's fantastic, but bloody hell did they reuse the same enemies over and over and over and over and over and over again. They just reskin them, like, fucking ten times each, man. Like, what enemies there are, 
for the most part, pretty cool. But Jesus. The blatant reskinning is just ridiculous. This one is mine. Like, it's not like they're fooling anyone. Like, everyone knows this is the same bee and dog we've seen 18 times. Like, everyone knows that. <laughs> like, we, you know, it's not working. We know it's the same enemy. It, it reminds me of when you play, like, a mod for a video game, right? And, you know, it makes sense, like, that they reskin enemies, because that's a really easy thing to do, comparative. Because all you gotta do is, like, switch out the texture, basically. Comparative to making, you know, your own enemy with your own models and animations and all that. It's basically what they do. They just, they just texture swap, like a modder. Like, wow. Perhaps you would like to know a bit about these planes. Oh, yeah, man, give me that lore, bitch. Mm -hmm. As you know, these planes were once a battlefield. A great battle between the Vel and Zanakan, the melee of Machina. I remember how that different war left this place a barren, lifeless land. Everything was in eight then and nine. Time passed. The summoners took note of this uninhabited land. Great battles could be fought here with no harm to the common folk. Think of all the cards you Perfect collect. For a final battle with sin, as it were. Summoners wait here. Ready to perform the final summoning. Ah, to know what they must feel. In any case, when Sin is defeated here, the calm will visit Spira once more. That's why this place is now known as the Calm Lands. Exactly who dubbed it so is unknown. And that, as they say, is that. You may notice he likes to say that as they say it's that, it's like his catchphrase. I mean, okay, when it comes to the reskin enemies, I, I get I get your logic is that, well, you know, when you see a rock dude, you're like, well, I hear that with Oren or Kamari. And when you see, like, a robot, you're like, I steal from it with Riku. When you see a flying thing, I thwack it with Waka. And you're not wrong. It makes it less confusing. But you got to remember, this is like a 100-hour RPG. Uh, well, you know, maybe like 50, 60, if you're not playing Blitzball all the time. It doesn't vary up the combat enough. At least outside of boss fights. A lot of the boss fights are very cool, but as far as regular enemies go, the encounters are basically play out exactly the same. Yo. What's going on? Yo. Yeah. Yo. Hello? Game? Um... Well, anyway, uh, I guess I think I finished my point. Uh, the encounters, when they don't, uh, you know, freeze, uh, play out basically exactly the same, because you're like, well, it's a blob dude, I shoot it with Lulu. It's a dog, I hit it with Titus. It's a flying thing, I hit it with Walker. It's a rock, I smack it with Auron. It's like a, an elemental thing, I made it with Lulu. So, basically just ends up exactly the same in every single fight. So, <laughs> you know. I don't know why this is happening, this is very strange. <laughs> okay. <laughs> uh, so yeah, I mean, whilst you're you're not wrong, it does simplify it. I would argue that it simplifies it far too much. It would be a lot more engaging as far as the combat goes, because you know it's quite a boss fight where you're like, oh, this is a tactic I can use. I can like dark this person and like you know, uh, fucking use a potion on it because it's like undead and all these different things you can do. Uh, you know, like, power break it to lower its physical strength, and, you know, like, silence it to stop it using magic, like, that type of thing. You don't have to do that in the regular combat, so the regular combat just becomes super grindy, because you're like, well, I click this, I click this, we're done. I have loaded the wrong save file, I should have loaded the autosave, son of a bitch. I'm so used to not loading the autosave, because normally that's way behind everything, but no, the autosave is actually going to be our best save here. That's, that's irritating. That's irritating. Yeah, um... So yeah, you know, I mean, you got to think, it would be nice, uh, you know, like, if you're playing, let's say you're playing Devil May Cry, or Bayonetta, or pfft, even something like Dark Souls, or Neo, Bloodborne, uh, less Bloodborne, I guess, but, um, uh, 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 what was the other one I was thinking of? But, but basically games like that, where, oh, God of War, where, you know, like, a new type of enemy shows up, and you're like, oh, this thing's weak against, like, ice weapons or whatever, or, you know, I can do this thing to it. Like, they have different strengths and weaknesses. You don't really get to experience that in Final Fantasy X after the first, like, couple of enemies, because you're like, oh, it's, it's this thing again. But it's a different color, and it's got different health. 
and it hits a bit harder. Can I skip Long this cutscene, please? God fucking damn. The high the oh, we road. can we can skip we can skip the dialogue. Beyond a little bit. <laughs> Many summoners. Yeah, mash the buttons. Mash the buttons. It's gonna fall on the floor and then won't help. All right, Buna, fall on the floor. God fucking damn it. There we go. So yeah, this is the comment. It's very calm here, except for all the monsters trying to kill you. That was a very weird bug there. It was like, the game didn't freeze. I just couldn't attack. I couldn't open the menu. I couldn't I've do anything. Known where to go. I can't skip this. Lame. All right, well, I guess we're watching the rest of the country. I... Get up, you lazy bitch. I won't let you die. Find a way. Somehow. Be back, huh? That'll teach her to sleep on the job. Walker, stop floating. Oh my god. It's so long! Let's go. I told you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Turn them on. Guess. I told you. I guess. I'm dead. Oh, motherfucker. I'll start recording again. Ah. Bloody hell. Hang on. I know. It's annoying. Hang on. Yep, yep. There we go. Man. Fucking piece of shit. Where's the record button? Okay. Yeah. Stop. Oh. Hey, Paso. Jesus Christ. All right. So uh, hopefully it works now. Uh, that was strange. Like, I, 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 again, I've experienced bugs and things on this version that I've never experienced on the console version. I have no idea what up with it. Jesus Christ. I have no idea what up with any of that shit. Can you stop beating the living crap out of Auron? Good God, people. Die, rock man. But yes, anyway. Uh, to finish my point. Uh, it, it, pretty much every encounter is the same. Like, yeah, occasionally you come across, like, a new enemy. You know, like, yeah, occasionally you do. But it's, like, kind of few and far between. For the most part, they're just the reskin versions of the exact same thing. So, the bosses are good. And I think the... Uh, I'm going to talk to this guy again, because there might be something you get for talking to him every time. So, oh, bollocks. Bollocks! Talk to me, you pointy-hatted tit. There we go. I'm going to skip it again. As you know, a great <laughs> anyway, so... That war. Then, Considering how the long the game is, they really should be mixing up the enemies more than they are. It, like they got, they clearly got very lazy with that. Like I still think this game is great. Like you know, Blitz was fantastic. I think the story overall was very good. The characters, etc., etc. And there's a lot of cool, you know, optional side stuff to do and what have you. There's a lot of cool bosses. There are the Dark Aeons, Penance, etc. They're all great, and I think the combat in general is good. But the problem is, they just they they, you don't, they don't make you do anything new in the combat outside of the boss fights. You don't have to think. You just grind through these enemies. It basically becomes like Dynasty Warriors. You're like, well, slash, 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 kill all the little riffraff, and then, oh shit, it's a boss I've actually got to try. So, yeah. Someone needs a new controller. No, the controller's fine. It's a, it's a PS4 controller. The controller's good, man. The controller's great. It's the game. The game's busted. Hello, Chocobo. Come here. All right, run away, you shit. Okay, you were right in front of me a second ago. How the hell did you move? Ah, no. Yeah, this is exciting. It's not like we killed this fucking thing 18 times. And we... Oh, God, I screwed up. Ah! No, don't hit the blob. There you go. Hit the robot. Yeah. Do it again. That's that's the blob. That's the blob. You're fired. You're actually fired. Bum, 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 bum. Thank God they have the quadruple speed though. Makes the uh, the same enemies a lot less painful. Okay, abilities. You know. That's why I don't really like grinding in this game. Uh, because uh, it's all the same friggin' thing. Every time. Again, the boss fights are great, but man. It's like the same ten fucking enemies. We'll get through this. Yeah! Bonk. Uh, bonk. Wait, shoot, hang on a minute. Oh, God damn man. Does Riku auto kill this thing? I feel like we tried and it didn't, right? I'm pretty sure I stole from it and it did not crumble. Oh no, they do crumble. Okay, cool. Yeah. Hello. 
Rinse Travel Rinse Travel Angels here. Your service well for fine wares and reasonable prices. Please consider making a purchase before crossing these vast plains. Got any weapons? Bloody hell! Jesus Christ, sir! Like you know, there hasn't been a shop for a while, so you're gonna rip me off. Look at that shape. That's expensive. Well, actually, no, it's not expensive. That's not what I meant. It's uh, got a lot of magic and strength, basically. It's got nothing to do with the expense. Uh, magic counter. Counts specifically magic, doesn't it? Uh, ice ward, water ward. That could be good. 15 grand, a lot more reasonable. 76! It's a lot of mana, though. Who's that for? Is that for, um... Well, it's for Auron, isn't it? The Bracer? Why would, why would Auron need that much magic? He's not a bloody mage. I mean, you can make him one, but... He's not. Uh, curative Taj Automate. Automate's nice, uh, but again, not not a huge deal. I don't know if we necessarily need any of this. I mean, I guess that like that's okay, but like that's eight, no, thirteen percent magic versus eight percent. It's not that big of an upgrade. I mean, it's 5%, you know? That's okay, but still. It's 5% worth it. I mean, it does have two spaces, so we could put stuff on it. So, you know what? I'll buy it just to just to try and try and upgrade it. Let's try and do that now. So, customize. Uh, what was it called? I actually cannot bloody remember. That's a problem. Is it going to be at the bottom? Oh my god, thank god there's a quick scroll. Oh, wow! There we go. So... We could put more stuff on this to make it better. We could put strength on it. That seems really pointless. That would cost a skill sphere? That's pretty good. It would cost like three uh, power spheres, but it's only 3% strength. I think you can only have... Uh, yeah, you can only have one of each. So you can't have like 10% and 10%, for example. Interesting. Ugh. Yeah, she already kills stealing from robots because she's an owl dead and they're... They know about machines, so she she's like Donatello, you know? She she messes with them when she's stealing. At least that's how I've always understood it. Evade Encounter, mm, again, not really worth the teleports there. Magic Booster is good, but we don't have a Turbo Ether. Double AP, also good. Do not have enough Mega Alexius. So what I'm seeing here is that there are good things we could do, but not right now, because we don't have what we need. So, what a bunch of shit. So I guess I'll just stick that on it. It's a rod of wisdom now. Lovely. You can keep the right. Well, actually, what I'm just selling. Still no ether. Yeah, I don't. I honestly don't think you can ever buy ethers in this game. I think you have to farm them. They're probably not hard to farm. There is actually probably a boss that will drop 99 of them uh, that you can farm in the um, the arena. From what I remember, there are things like that where they will drop a shitload of one thing. Or at least you can still. Well, I can't remember how it works, but. When you're asleep. Yeah. Uh, but yeah, we, we don't have access to the arena right now. However, we are right next to the arena. It's just on the other side of the uh, the plains. I stole from the wrong thing. No! Uh, get Tyson in here. Die, doggy. Yeah. Really? You, you bitch nipple. All right. Revive this person. There we go. Deal. Thank you. Oh, grenades. Sweet. Also because Albert of Fantasy Gypsies. I'll take your word for that. I'm I'm staying away from the mild racism, but uh, that's what the man says. What is that weird spiky thing over there? I feel like it's important somehow. Also, if I recall, isn't Tyus' celestial weapon down here? Like, you have to... Yeah, you see down there? It's like, you gotta go touch something in the wall, but you have to have his crest and his sigil, and then you get it, and you're like, I got it, and it's great, and you're like, wow, this is really cool, and then you can do tons of damage. And it, from what I remember, it looks kind of like Brotherhood, but not, if you know what I mean, so it's sort of like blue and... If you if you are familiar with, um, with, what's his face? You know the guy... You know the... What's his name? Oh, why is this good? Cloud. If you're familiar with Cloud from Final Fantasy VII, his ultimate weapon called Ultima Weapon, uh, that thing. It looks a lot like that, if I remember correctly. Anyway, what the hell are these spikes? No idea. Seems to do nothing. There's like a little path here, I think. You have to sort of like pull around. I can't remember exactly how the hell you get to it, but uh, like a sneaky little path. Dead trees. 
Oh look, a new enemy. Oh fucking time. Uh, these things are a pain in the ass. They use bare breath and it like basically kills your entire team. And they use it all the damn time. However, we can launch it bad breath, so we should do that. Special give me bad breath. Thank you. Very kind. Uh, we should probably... I don't know what we'd be able to do to stop it. Would silence work? I don't know. Is it a magic attack? I don't think so. It's also immune to silence. Who will then? Uh... Honestly, no clue what we should be using on this. Yeah, Marlboros are, uh, they're very deadly. Oh, hey, we got lucky. It didn't matter with me. That also hurts like hell. I think that, I think that can lower your armor, that attack. Maybe. Maybe not all the time. Yeah, I think, it, I think it essentially has, like, armor break on it. Uh, you know, like, Auron's ability. Um, I'm gonna try and thrust kick it out of battle. That could be a laugh. Probably doesn't work because it's too big. Yep. It is too big. Well, that sucks. Uh, it's Lulu, this bitch. It's got tons of health. It's not like it's gonna live. I mean, survive. I mean, not die. Look, I'm tired. Uh, I'm very tired. <laughs> this is what Nightbirds will do. They'll make you wake up way too early. Fire is good, yes. If only I could get, like, a decent rotation on this. A fire's okay. It's alright. I've had worse. Uh, who have we not used? I... <sighs> Probably not Riku. I don't remember if we even used Luna. Remedy's good. Oh, there's Bad Breath. Alright, awesome. We're probably all dead. Yeah. Oh, Orin is Berserk. But also blinded, so he can't... Oh, good. Oh, oh, good. Oh, oh, good. Oh, good. These things will fuck you up. So, we can't control Orin because he's Berserk. So he just auto-attacks. That's what Berserk is. She's Berserk as well, so she's going to do the same thing. Riku is the only one who isn't Berserk, but she's confused. So she's just going to auto-attack her teammates, the Marlboro, herself, anything. There was a poison, which means they're taking poison damage this entire time. So if the poison kills her, our team is dead. We are dead. We have died. There's nothing we can do now. Like, li literally guaranteed death. Might be a little OP. Uh, the Bad Breath attack might be a little bit OP. This is why you need... Um, to equip abilities, like, you know, um, Berserk Ward or, you know, Confusion Ward and that type of thing. There you go, game over, just dead. I think that was our first death in the game, correct me if I'm wrong. Just, just dead. You can't reflect it. Bad Breath is not a magic attack. It is just, it's just an attack that it has. It does, I don't think it counts as even a physical attack. It's just like a special thing that it does. So, yeah, unless you have wards against that stuff, you are fucked. Uh, is this really my closest save? I hate everything. Oh my god! Are you kidding me? Is this really my closest save? Jesus Christ! Alright, we have to run away when we see a Marlboro for now. We, we can't deal with those things. We do not have... We do not have the ability. Beyond the we have to run away. We have to instantly get out of there before it bad breaths us. I thought the auto save would be closer. You know? Nope. Not at all. This is the third time we've seen this fucking cutscene. One time because it froze. <laughs> kind of. And one time because of Marvel or bad breath us and we couldn't do anything about it. Oh my god. I hate you. I hate you right now, Final Fantasy. I love you, but right now I fucking I've hate you. I don't care about this no, cutscene! Can we play Minesweeper or something in the meantime? Hang on. Do I have Minesweeper? Probably not, right? Can you play Minesweeper online? <laughs> Hang on a minute. I... What else can we play while we're doing this? I'll find a way somehow. Open up Steam. Um hmm, what's quick? Let's play Dead Cells. Let's just play Dead Cells. Bum ba bum ba bum 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 ba bum ba bum 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 Which you can't see dead cells because again it's doing that thing with the screen to show up. I would find a way. Oh what if I capture it here? I guess I wanted to believe that words could make it come true. Shut up, Titus! 
that way. There you go. All right, it's too late now. It took so long that the cutscene. Oh, he's running. He's running. He's running. He's off on his own. Look at him go. What a champ. All right, hang on. I got. I got to close dead cells now. There's no getting the dead cells music. All right. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, I don't want to talk to Lawman again, but I feel like he had something to do. I don't fucking know. You know, I'm putting off the battles. Fuck this shit. I'm not dealing. I'm not. I'm, not, I'm actually not dealing with that. I'm so like tilted that they killed me. I'm, I'm just, well, I'm tapping out of the battles. We'll come back here later and do the battle. And if, you know, if we need to grind, we can grind. But we can grind somewhere where there's not a fucking Marlboro to kick my ass. Screw that shit. Or at least, you know, when we're next to a save point. So we can save between Marlboros, you know, murdering the shit out of us. But yeah, not, not a good idea to be, uh... Be running around here with battles on it. If we don't have to, and we don't have to, so yeah, fuck that. We're gonna get to the save point. That's gonna be, that's gonna be, that is not battles off. There we go. Gonna get to the save point. All right, let's skip through this again. Oh my fucking god, I did it again. Talk to, ah! Talk to me, you old bastard. As you, know, you old shit. A great oh lord, a great war lord. was fought here and over Zanuck and Sin and, and Spear and Akam and Summoners. And that, as they say, is that. What a load of bollocks, anybody. you Wait, old git. Oh my god, hurry up with the fucking dialogue. Jesus Christ. Oh dear, I almost forgot to tell you something. Oh, what are you telling me? What have they got? There's a chasm. A great rend in the earth. Great rend. A scar left from High Summoner Gandalf's bitter battle with Sin 400 years past. Funny enough, you're actually about to learn Kamari's backstory. Like, right after this section, we go to Mount Gagazette, which is where the Ronsos are from. And Kamari is a Ronso. Okay, so let's rebuy this fucking stuff. God! Asshole! Where is it? Was that always 76 grand? That seems very expensive. Yeah, I guess it was. What a rip. What a bloody rip. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Shut your face. On fit. No customization. Screw it all the bloody way down. Yeah, I'm gonna get the save point first because I'm not risking another Marlboro killing us. Fuck that. I'd be, I'd be, you know, less bothered about it had the game not froze and made me watch that cutscene an extra time, but it did. So, uh, screw that shit. Yeah, well, so the save points are over here, so we should have just made a beeline for this. Oh, look who it is! Isn't that the bitch that we can fight? Belgiamine, or whatever her name is. We'll do that in a minute, but, uh, first of all, save point. Yeah, I had a feeling people showed up here. They're talking. Get that shit off the screen. Father Zook. Long Zook. time no see. You are Yuna? Hmm. You certainly don't look like Mr. Kinok's murderer. What you say? Oh god, I almost choked on my ST. <laughs> Please tell us what has happened. Tell us what has happened. Mr. English. Micah just issued a personal order, you know. It said that you and your guardians murdered Maester Kinok and fled. We are to kill you on sight, or so it says. What of Bavel? Things are calm on the surface, but the depths are turbulent. After the death of Maester Kinok, Kelk Ronso left Yevon. Convenient. Getting around will be easier with Yevon in disarray. But be careful, my friends. You have been branded enemies of Yevon. You should avoid temples for the time being. Thank you, Father Zook. Stay away from those religious way. folk. Father, you came all the way here just to tell us this? To tell the truth, I was a little curious to see... this summoner you are guarding. I hope her pilgrimage goes well. For your sake. Well, too. it's been a shit show so far, what with the game freezing Thank and then a Marlboro murdering me, but thanks, I appreciate the I sentiment. I shall pray for all of you. Praise be to Blitzball. Bum 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 I like Lulu's red eyes. They're creepy. Hello. Messy. What is? Yevon, Micah and Seymour are not of one mind. Remember what Seymour said last we met. I do not think Micah will concur. What did he say? I was too busy kicking his ass to hear him. 
She's not stopping, is she? Yuna, she's made her decision. But I can't just let her go. We won't have to. We'll save Yuna even if she calls the final Aeon. But how? Mm, I'll think of a way. Yeah. You can't. I'm tired of talking to you. Oh shit. It's always but this, but that. But he let her have it. Let's think together. Okay. And if we can't think of something, we find another way. We'll just hit it really hard. <laughs> Look at her holding her head like, no. This guy's crazy. He's never going to work, man. Uh, this is a toughie. You look actually insane. So, we are officially traitors then. Well, you know. Hey, I mean, let them say what they want. We did try and kill it's, a maester. It's okay. Twice. I'm not worried. Well, it was it three times now? We fought Seymour a couple, at least. A little. It's so hard not to be. Hey, it's okay to worry. And if it gets too rough, just yell. <laughs> yeah. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. I might just do that. Oh, I'm yeah. sorry. If it gets too rough, just yell. It made me laugh. Who was that? Until half a year ago, he was a summoner. Waka and I were his guardians. It's kind of a short pilgrimage. He gave up halfway. Here, on this plane. Probably a fucking Marlboro. Now he is a monk at the Bavel Temple. Game probably throws on his bitch ass too. He's probably like, fuck this noise. What up, Walker? When I was guarding Zook. I already told you this, yeah? About when I was too into the game to be a good guardian. The safe word is out. So, when Father Zook said he wanted out. Tell you the truth, I was kind of glad. Yeah, I like Blitzball too, Walker. You're on my Blitzball team. Gagazet is Ronso land. I'm gonna find out of home. Hmm. Uh, hey, we might meet your family. Kimari has no family. Oh, uh, sorry. But Kimari not alone. That's nice for you, Kimari. Is there any chests or anything around here? I feel like I feel like there should be, but there's not. That's weird. Excuse me. You're in the bloody way. Uh, what about you? What are you selling? Welcome. Uh, do you have the same crap as the other dude? No, you have a Baroque stuff. Hmm. Bunch of basic bitch gear, really. Yes, nothing, nothing too interesting. What about? <coughs> excuse me. What about? Oh my god. What about items? Probably the same stuff as the other dude. Holy water. Is that for zombies? Yeah. Cure zombie and Hmm. We want that. We we definitely want it. Buy ten of those. And those. How are we doing all this stuff? Pretty good. Pretty good. We only get nineteen grenades. Let's buy another. Yeah, it's round up to 30. Round the higher potions up. We want regular potions. They're only restored 200 at this point. It's kind of shockingly bad. So, meh. Meh. That'll do. That'll do, pig. That'll do. What a misery. I am fine. How are you? How was life? Okay. Uh, are we done talking to everyone? I wonder if my father got lost here too. I mean, clearly not. Maybe, with my old man helping him. Maybe I'll ask Sir Oren. He did defeat Sin Oren? and all that. Well, that grouch never tells me anything. <laughs> that is none of your business. <laughs> <laughs> not that he keeps out of other people's business. That was you creepy. Know what I mean? That did not sound like Yuna's voice at all. That was weird. If you haven't found us, so will Spira. Founders? If you haven't founders. Does he mean flounders? Founders? I don't understand what you're talking about, but whatever. Uh, battle's off. Not dealing with the Marlboros right now. Fuck no. Screw that shit. We will not quadruple speed across the plains. We'll take it at the normal pace. But we're just doing it with no battles, you know? We're just doing it with no battles. Um, again... There's a bunch of stuff around here. It might not look like it, but there is, even though it's like a massive open section of nothingness for the most part. If you see down here in the bottom right, like if I use my mouse cursor, see like here on the minimap, there is um, 
I think you need a chocobo and you can like jump across there and there's like a secret temple thing over there where you can get one of the summons. I think actually the most powerful summon, or like one of them anyway. Uh, as you can see, this was a chest here. And again, there's that thing, the path sort of on the left hand side with the uh, Tyus' celestial weapon, but we need the sigil and the crest. I think we have one of them. Uh, but I can't remember. We certainly don't have both. I think the moon is like. Units? And the Mars might be his? Either way, we only have one sigil. So we need, you know, like Moon Crest, Moon Sigil, or whatever it is. Uh, so yeah, we, we cannot get his uh, Celestial Weapon yet, but it is there. It's like in the, in the wall or something. I think it's like a blue thing you can touch or something. Founder equals fail or breakdown. Never heard it used in that context before. That's interesting. Can I catch a Jokobo? Excuse me, what are you doing, sir? Come back, you shit! Where do you go? Dude, this guy's fast as hell. He's actually the quickest man on Earth. Uh, yeah, you see? It's got the feather on the ground, and, you know, remember last time we had a, a chocobo, we could use the feathers to jump? I don't know why that is. I, I don't think it's that you're using the feathers. It's more just that that represents, you know, a feather falling off a chocobo whilst it was jumping, I guess? I don't really know. But yeah, I don't know if we have to catch them or what. Or if we get them from the travel agency, maybe? But let us try and catch one and see what happens. Well, so you cannot get battles on the back of Chocobo. That would be sweet, wouldn't it? Oh, cannot catch it. All right. Let's go back to the travel agency, see if we can book a Chocobo. Then again, she didn't offer that, did she? She's just still grabbing her head. Uh, oh, it's over here. Here we go, here we go. Wait, no, this isn't... This is something else, I think. Uh, I have a message from Sid. He said, we've, uh, we've, we've done something, oh, <laughs> what, uh, we've something, something, the airship, uh, we've something to repair the airship, uh, come, You, then, you when we're done. We'll come find you when we're done? When you, yeah, we'll come find you when we're done. Until then, keep Yuna safe, or you'll be sorry, kid. Yeah, I got, I got most of that. It was a little confusing. Uh, but yeah, again, I'm pretty sure you can hire a chocobo here. But, probably on the return visit. It doesn't look like we can do it right now. Uh, but let's try and find the Celestial Weapon area, even if we can't get it right now, just to see what it's like. Uh, how do we do this again? Again, I think we have to go from... sort of this side? If I remember, the path is a little bit hidden. Oh my god, I'm stuck. I'm stuck. Wait, wait, it's an Albert Promo. Sweet. I think it's like here, and then you can sort of go... Yes, I think it's all the way over here. Yeah, here we go. Sneaky. Hello. If I don't know what I'm watching for, Judy's Judy. I'm not moving. Well, unless something really unique happens, that is. Are you blocking me? Ah, okay. So we can't even go down there yet. Again, we don't have what we need, so I don't really know why they block you. I don't know if there's anything else down there, but I don't think there is. Yeah, that's where you get it. Uh, I, seem, I think I remember where you get Lulu's. Apart from that, I really cannot remember where the hell you got the rest of the Celestial Weapons. Why Lulu's, I don't know. But, uh... Yeah, that one, for some reason, that one kind of sticks out in my mind. Isn't it, like, near where you get, um... You know what? I don't want to spoil that, so I'm going to shut up. Right. Uh, again, the arena is around here. It's just on the right. Oh! Del Jumine was chilling, wasn't she? Let's go have a look for her. Del Jumine was sort of... Over here somewhere. Oh my god, these bloody ledges. Oh, I hate them. I hate them so goddamn much. There we go. Hello, Belgiumini. Oh, you again. You're quite the notorious trader these days. Oh, are you. What's it to you? <laughs> oh, you shouldn't take what the Maesters say too seriously. For summoners, destroying sin is everything. We are no tools of Yevon. Understand? Yes. Sure, Princess Layla. So, Layla. <laughs> I, I do not know. I'm familiar with Star Wars. <laughs> You've got spirit. 
But you'll need more to beat Sin. An Aeon duel. Show me what you're made <laughs> of. Hey, I created you straight away. All right, let's go, bitch. You have me. Your princess Leia knockoff. I've just healed your Aeons for you. Let us begin. The word cosplay, bitch. <laughs> and yes, I know it was Leia's hair that looked like that, but still. Again, the amount of inspiration and references in these games to Star Wars, that's not a coincidence, my friends. That's not a coincidence. Oh, I guess I'll just use my fire summon. You muppets. Go away for it, do my bidding. Yeah. Oh, I'm going to be weak against you as well. Isn't this like a two-way street? This, they haven't thought this through, have they? They haven't thought this through at all. Fire! 300. 300. Click the attributes in the Aeons menu to raise the attributes of your Aeons. Use the Aeons to confirm your Aeons weakness by raising the physical weak sheep. The physically weak sheep with HP are increasing you. Hmm. Okay. Yeah, Sheaver is really quick. How the hell did I do so little damage? What? Well, that was dreadful. Okay, apparently our Ifrit is weak as shit right now. I mean, she's not exactly hitting like a truck either. It's like we're both just using wet fish. My god. Oh yeah, cheating. You did more damage than I did, didn't you? Cheating bitch. She's getting overdrive out of this as well. I'm not okay with it. I can't remember doing 300 damage. That she makes me sad. That is just awful. Eh. God damn it. Aha! Uh -huh. I'm just gonna use it now. You know what? At this rate, I feel like I can get another one before uh, before we die. Actually, we can also heal ourselves, so I should probably save my magic for that. That's smart, Jason. That's thinking with portals. I did 9999. Are you kidding me? I was doing like 100 damage with an attack, but I did 9999 with the, with the overdrive. Doesn't make any sense. <laughs> oh god, she's got one. No! Heal yourself. Hair me. Beautiful. How about you don't kill me with this? Wait, where did her overdrive go? She didn't use diamond dust, she used uh she used her special attack like this thing. What? What? Where'd her overdrive go? She just lost it. I mean yeah, I'll take it, I get that's weird. I'm putting this battle up. This battle's too slow. I think she might be dead now. They did specifically say that she had low HP. So I'm guessing a good 10,000 will, uh, 20,000, sorry, will do it. Yep. You suck. You, uh, you suck. Is that the only summon you have? Surely you have more than that, right? You got like a Bahama in there or something? Yo, red eyes, black dragon. Stop. That is enough. That's all you have? It was pathetic. Also, how long ago did we get Shiva and you're just whipping it out now? I mean, I know we haven't seen her in a while, but what the hell? <sighs> Impressive. Remarkable talent. I mean, not really. That was... Traitor or no, you may have what it takes it was to... It's fucking sin. easy. Take this. You have earned you it. You might not want to watch out for the Marlboros, darling, because they'll kick the shit out of you. Thank you. Aeon Soul. I think you will do just fine. I don't know what it does. But if you ever feel like you want more training... I think it's good. Seek the hidden temple of Remium. I will be waiting there. The, the hidden Farewell. temple is uh, the one I told you about in the corner with the chocobo feather. Okay, possessing the ansel. Uh, I should raise the ant stats. Oh, uh, select attributes. Yeah, gives, I'm guessing this is why she gave me a ton of power spheres. Yes, we can use power spheres to raise the HP. It costs 23? That's random. Why do we 23? Alright, whatever. Maybe it depends on how strong they are or something. I don't know. Well, we can raise the strength as well. That's a trick. Alright, I get the point. I don't need this tutorial anymore. Yeah, I understand. Yeah. I got it. It's just like everything else. I use materials to do stuff. I understand. He's not rocket science game. Thank you. Okie dokie. Um, so we go to Aeon. Go to attributes. I mean, we, we, if we're smart, we just buff Bahamut. Let's be honest here. Uh, so what does it cost for him? It costs... Is that 30... 31. 31. Raise it by 100. What about his strength? Raise it by 1. Oof. 19 spheres. We should use some of these because we do have 99. But 
Uh, one, one point. Cost me twenty. That would cost me f twenty again. Okay. Hmm. I'll save the rest. We buffed his damage a little tiny bit. All right. Let us go back and save. Uh, actually, we don't really need to save. We got battles off. We've already run around here. So you've seen basically everything. The calm lands besides the arena. Again, there's not... There's a few things here, but most of we can't do yet. There's also a chugbo race, uh, which I think is for actually... I think it's for the other item that we need for Tyce's, uh Celestial Weapon. The chugbo race, it has checkpoints. Uh, and when you go through a checkpoint, it lowers your time. And you actually have to beat the race with under zero seconds on the clock. So you have to hit all the checkpoints really quick, basically. So that you end up with negative time. Uh, yeah. And that's that's how you do it. She, I mean, yeah, she's testing me. She's not, like, trying to kill me. I, I, this has always been weird to me. It's a weird dragon head thing. You just examine it, and it's like, it's alive. And that's just, it's just it. It's just like this weird fish dragon thing wrapped around it. Never really understood that. Yeah, I mean, I, I, I get she's testing me, but... Test me hard on that, could you? This is a training area that Lord Mihang instructed for the Crusaders. You can hone your battle skills here by fighting fiends gathered from all over Spira. But the fiends all got away because I uh, screwed up. I'm too old to gather fiends now, so I'm in quite a fix. Quite a pickle of a dilly of a jam. So that's where you come in, Sunny. And ask you to round up all the fiends for me. Of course, I'm not asking you to do it for free. There'll be nice fat rewards. On top of that, you can hone your fighting skills anytime against the fiends you bring back here. Additionally, items you win during training are yours to keep for free. Uh, but there will be a small fee for each training session, so bear that in mind. You have to pay, yes. But it's not that much. How about it? Not a bad deal, eh? You won't regret it. You also get money from the fight, so... Uh, sorry, no time for that. Alright, I'll do it. Uh, I'll do it. That's the spirit. Sunny, now go catch all them fiends. But I've got one more warning for you before I can let you go. Uh, to catch fiends, you have to have de defeat it with a special kind of weapon. But not to worry, I'll sell them to you for a special price. Also, this arena can only hold 10 of each kind of fiend. There won't be any bonuses for capturing more, so keep an eye on your totals. I need you to start by collecting each species in the Calmlands. I can't reopen the arena without having some fiends, you know. By the way, there's a total of 9 species in the Calmlands. I'll give you a bonus when you get all of them. Oh, before I forget... You have to use a special kind of weapon to catch him. You fucking told me! I'll sell some of you. I'll sell some to you for a special price. No, no, no need to thank me. Mm hmm. Yeah, okay. Uh, taming sword. Yeah, okay. So, yeah. I mean, you, you get the idea. He basically explained it. We, uh. Gonna put it on you and then capture him. Would that work if she mages them? Probably not, right? I'm going to guess probably not, so I'm going to go with Auron, Walker, and Titus for the catchers. That is all! And then we're going to... Oh my god, they're in the party already, how convenient. So yeah, we probably should capture all the ones in the Calm Lands before we carry on. Which means, yes, we need to do battling. But hey, we just saved, so what we should do is... Yeah, we got to capture Town Marlboro, that's not going to be easy. Let's be honest, that's going to be bloody difficult. Hey, we captured a waspy thing. Uh, robot doesn't mean shit. So we can always go back to the arena and, like, figure out how many we've got. And thank God for quadruple speed, because it's going to make this, yes, you guessed it, four times quicker. Approximately. So, uh... Yeah. Normally it doesn't take that long, to be honest. Uh, I don't know if it works when you slice and dice, but let's try. Or more specifically when you use an overdrive, but, uh, we're going to try that out for a test. Because, you know, if we lose... We, worst case scenario, we're going to lose, like, a rock dude out of this and a bug. I really don't care that much. Yeah, it didn't say captured, so I think not. I think not. Yeah, this is where it's going to be a bit more of a pain in the ass, so like capturing the blobs, for example. Again, I'm pretty sure if we mage it with Lulu, even though she has a capture weapon, I think you have to physically attack them, but you can just thwack them a couple of times. It's not that bad. I mean, we call them Titus because they're dumb. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I did say that. It triggers me so much, man, though, that people, uh, like, even after all these years, they're like, but... But, but Walker calls him Titus in, in in Kingdom Hearts. Yeah, but Walker also has a weird fake Jamaican accent. And the man, like... Again, the water theme. It's Titus, like Tidal Wave. Like, come on now, people. What's wrong with you? Come on now. Alright, why don't we just kill Titus? Why don't you just kill Titus? You dick. I wish we could save out in the bloody calm lands without having to come back in here. I mean, it's you know, it's not that far. We should just do it right by the arena, but... I wish it was like, you know, a world map where we could just go in the menu and save down there. But alas, there is no world map in this game. You basically access that by flying to it. So, you know, it's a little different. Die, Rockman! 
I did nothing. You are terrible. You are fired. But yeah, this is going to require a little bit of grinding. Uh, normally I would do this off camera, but like I said, it's one of those things where he did specifically say to open up the arena, he would require the ones from the Carmelands first. So I'm guessing, therefore, that we probably cannot capture things from other areas until we've done this one. I may be wrong, that may not be the way it works, but I think it might be. So given that, this is why we're going to do this now. Like I say, normally I just do this off camera. For the most part, I will do this stuff off camera. But for this one, just so we can sort of capture things as we're progressing through the rest of the game, uh, to save ourselves a bit, or save me a bit of grinding off camera later, uh, yeah, it's better that I do it now. At least, again, assuming I'm correct about him saying that we have to do this section first, which I, I seem to remember that being the case. So, you know. And again, it's not going to take that long to capture 10 of everything, except the Marlboros. The Marlboros are going to be the problem, because as you've seen, they're not incredibly common, and the reason for that is because they don't want you to die every 10 steps in the bloody Carmelands. They know how dangerous those things are. And we are going to have to, um... Yeah, actually, we should do that now. We should work on having something to at least get rid of either Berserk or Confusion, so that when we do encounter Marlboros, they don't absolutely beat the living shit out of me. So... Let's right now try to customize equipment, uh, which means we probably should buy some blank equipment. Uh, or at least see what they have. None of that's any use. Um, here's what we're going to do. We're actually going to turn off the battles real quick, so we can whiz back over to the shop, and we're going to see if they have any decent defensive equipment that has some slots. Because I think they do. You can capture in different areas first. Are you sure? Different areas of the commands may have different fiends, and I like the grindy bits, to be honest. It's an achievement when it's done. I mean, it is, but, you know, I don't know how fun it is to watch. Uh, the shop was over here, wasn't it? It was this dude in the weird June buggy space age thing. Wait, where'd he go? He fucked off. Oh, really? You left? You bag of dicks. God damn it. Um, well, that's a problem. I think this person also was selling armor, maybe? Yeah, I can't remember. Were you selling armor? Uh, they have some, but it doesn't have that much space. I mean, we have we have some stuff. You're positive I can capture in other areas first. Okay, well then I won't do it right now. It's it's better if we do it later, honestly, because then later we can have more access to you know anti confusion, anti berserk, and therefore the Marlboros aren't going to absolutely bloody destroy me every time. So it is actually better that I do this later when we're better prepared for the Marlboros. So you always get the airship first. All right. Well. We'll see about that, won't we? We'll bloody see. I really want to slice... I actually will slice and dice them, just because... We do still want to unlock Tice's other overdrive. Even though he's probably going to destroy half of what we capture here. But again, it's not like these things are rare, you know? If this was like a Marlboro or something, I'd be a lot more careful about capturing it. But it ain't. It doesn't really matter that much. The bugs are common as hell anyway, plus they usually come in too, so... It doesn't really matter when you lose a bug. Know what I'm saying? No, I'm saying. I guess anyway, we are we are pretty close to Kamari's era. Can we get Yojimbo here? Because I know the next load screen we go through, there's like a split path. I mean, if, if we sort of go down towards the camera and round to the right, there's like a cave you can go in and Yojimbo's in there, but I don't know if he's in there yet. Plenty of bugs in this game, yeah. Certainly are in this version. Aha! Uh -huh. We're talking about a different kind of bug. Get clobbered. You blob bastard. Is this just me or is that blob a really nice shade of reddish orange? It's a lovely color. I mean, I wouldn't like paint my walls with it or anything, but it's a nice color. It visually pleases me. Okay, leave me alone. God damn it, I fucking carry. Again, I pretty normally turn the battles off, but I mean, we need to capture them anyway, so. Don't worry, I wish the robots wouldn't show up. I remember the robots annoying me, like, back in the day doing this, because, like, you can't fucking capture a robot. You can't. So every time they bloody shot, like capturing those, you know, remember those big worms in the desert that suck you in? Yeah, you got to capture those as well. And those fucking robots that keep showing up in the Albert Desert, and you're like, oh my god. Like, you can't capture them. So it's just a waste of time. Those things are quite rare around here as well. They're called Toromar or something. Guys. Oh, Corel. I think they are called Toromar in some of the other games. Uh, These things, I think, can petrify you? Again, lots of things turn you to stone in this game. It is, it is a lovely pussy. Uh, they also apparently have a shitload of health. Jesus! The hell, man? Wait, why are these things on fire? 
Were they always like that? I don't know. All right, we got one of those. Uh, let's just beat these things up. Actually, by the way, <laughs> did I accidentally hit the the uh, the overdrive button? I don't think I did, right? Because everyone has an overdrive. I don't know. I feel like I accidentally hit it, but I don't think I did. Ah, oh, bollocks! But yes, there are recolored versions of those cats later on as well, which will come as no surprise to anyone. Yeah. Did I not overkill the left one? Chip. Don't hurt the kitty cat. Dude, the kitty cat had it coming. Alright. He had it coming. What we should do actually is put some. Because don't these weapons have some space? Yes. We should put like some damage up or something on these weapons. Oh, bloody hell. I can't remember what they're called. They're probably actually the last things we have. Yeah, I wish I wish it was like ordered from top to bottom, like top would be the newest. That would make sense. There we go. Uh, yeah, we should put like damage on these things if we can. Like that. Oh, it costs a skill speed. No, I don't want to use that. I mean, you could put like 3%, but that seems like a waste. 3% is nothing. It's a pittance. It disgusts me, quite frankly. Quite frankly, it disgusts me. We should at this point be switching people in to battle to get EXP. Uh, but I'm lazy. Mm. Here's what we're going to do. We're going to turn the off. We're going to run back to the arena. And I'm actually going to get a capture weapon for everyone. Because I want to make sure that if anyone participates in battle, I don't have to, like, specifically switch in the people that are capturing. It's just easier to give everyone a weapon. It's going to be expensive as fuck. So if I've collected five from the calm lands, you've got four more to go. You'll find weak visions nearby, but go search the northwest for the big game. Yes, if you remember, we were in the northwest when the Marlboro showed up. He's not wrong. There are specific sections of maps. They don't really sh tell this to you apart from, like, this one time. But, like, if you recall, um, when we were fighting those giant worms in the Albert Desert, there was that place sort of to the left, like, the northwest with the ruins. That's, like, Worm City around there. They're always around the area. So if you're looking for those worms specifically, you want to run around those ruins. What up, Khalid? Did I say that right? I think I did. Hello, you did make it. Welcome. How are you doing? Uh, okay, so who else needs... Uh, I guess it's just all these people down here, isn't it? Yes, Tanning Sphere. Again, I can't remember if you have to do a physical attack with the Mock, or if you can just mage them. I'm pretty sure you have to do a physical attack. Why not buy another one? God damn it, you idiot. Oh, you're the one who needs one. Okay, okay let's sell back the, uh, the extra that we bought like a Muppet. I like this music. It sounds... um. Somewhat Arabian, like a bit sort of, you know, uh, what's, 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 that, what's that game called? Uh, well, not game, but uh, yeah, yeah, work with me. Hang on, show me the things I've captured so far. Two are unknown. Wait, there's two we're missing? One's the Marlboro. What the hell's the other one? I don't know. I don't know. Um, Aladdin is what I was going to say. It sounds, it sounds a bit like Aladdin at times. Uh, save, please. Thank you. I'm going to make a backup save. <laughs> going to make a backup save. Lovely. All right. Get out of this hellhole. Well, either way, we should probably run around to the northwest when we want to capture stuff here. I'll try and remember that, because that's, uh, that's a handy tip. It's a handy tip. But yeah, that's just, generally, that would be my advice if you're trying to capture stuff. Is uh, just sort of experiment in different sections of the map. Because, yeah, they don't show you or really tell you. Apart from that one time, they kind of directly say it. But, yeah, it doesn't just count for the calm lands. It counts for pretty much every section of the map. There's usually areas that are going to have tougher encounters. Halt! You're going to watch the whole thing on YouTube. Sweet. Summons from Lord Seymour. Come with us. We have nothing to discuss nah. with Maester Seymour. Yeah, so out of our way. Oh, Tyus is serious. Lord Seymour's commands must be obeyed. You will come. I warn you. The Maester doesn't need you alive. Oh, I don't need you alive. I've killed plenty of Guado. <laughs> Big rock going thing. That's a boss, right? It's probably a boss. It's a boss. I feel like this thing has a gimmick. I can't remember what the gimmick is right now. 
Then I guess you need piercing. Uh, Defender X. I remember the name. Professor X. Yeah, okay, so we can only attack one section of it. We're gonna need to switch our weapon is the problem. Well, I mean, need is a strong word. You know, we can kill it with the capture weapons, but it's obviously gonna take a bit longer. But I mean, to be fair, you know, we've got like maybe, what, 15% more damage on our best weapons? It's not that big of a deal. 15% is not the end of the world, and I'm kind of lazy, so I might just leave it. Um, probably gonna use physical attack, so we'll try Dark Buster. Okay, didn't say it was immune, so... Holy shit. Yeah, didn't say it was immune, so it's probably susceptible to that, so we probably want to power break it. Seems quite likely. Oh, it's immune to power break. Oh dear. Oh, that's the gimmick. I vaguely remember that. So I think that punch like half your current HP or something like that. And as you may have noticed, we do want piercing for this thing because Auron did bugger all damage. So I will switch specifically to the piercing weapons on Auron and Kamari. But other than that, it's not that big of a deal. Uh, let's try Silence, not Silence, Dark Buster. I like his ball there. It looks like um, looks like the spiny shells from Mario Kart. Again, that being a special attack is still going to hit. That's the problem. Those are the ones that will miss when it's blind. Uh, it's a boss I read out last will works. Oh my god, 60,000 HP? Bloody hell. This spell is going to be a pain in the ass. Yeah, it seems to be a counter attack. Yes, so it does do half. That's what I thought. Alright. Uh, let's try and steal it with you, I suppose. Gimme, gimme. Lunar Curtains. They're pretty good from what I remember. Uh, did I switch his weapon yet? No, I didn't. Son of a bitch. Uh, and turn. Yeah, okay. That'll do, pick. That'll do. Oh my god, speed up. No! We're gonna kill her. Okay, we need to rest, people. Everyone is low health. It might have an attack that hits everyone. I honestly don't know. We don't have full life yet. I thought we were close to full life, but probably not, actually. It's probably one of the last things you get. Dark bastarding you. Eh. Again, it's not going to do anything against its... Yeah, that. Blast Punch, but... Again, Blast Punch can't kill you. Just half your health, so... Honestly, not that big of a deal. As long as those miss, that's that's a deadly attack. Uh, Titus... Have I used Titus? I don't think so. Um, what we should definitely do is start hasting people. Let's haste him, let's haste him so that he can haste other people quicker. That's my logic. Uh, Walker, I'm not going to worry about healing. I maybe should, but I'm not. Lulu might be one of our best attackers here. I don't think this thing had any sort of... I doubt Demi's going to work, but we'll try. I don't think this thing had any sort of elemental weaknesses or strengths. Yeah, it's bloody immune. That's what I thought. Lame. Lame! Walker, hurry up, sir, before that happens. <gasps> she dodged it because she's a champ. Jack Buster. Oh my god, stop it. Okay. And then we haste our Lulu. No, no, not the boss. Do not want to haste the boss. At least you saw the demi visual effect. Yeah, again, it's it's a very niche spell. It doesn't have that much... There's not many enemies that are going to be particularly, you know, susceptible to it, because... Most of the enemies are going to be immune to it if it's going to be particularly useful, which they do then like every Final Fantasy. It's like, ugh. And then the rest of the time, if an enemy's low enough, like level or whatever, and you know, not, not a boss basically, that Demi's actually going to work on them, you're probably not going to need Demi because you can just like one or two shot them anyway, you know? So, yeah. Kind of redundant most of the time. There's probably a couple of bosses that it will work on just so it's not redundant. That's usually the way it works. But yeah, generally, it's pretty bad. Disappointingly. Oh my god. Goddamn counterattacks. Uh, okay, so how much damage are we doing with Lulu? Have we even seen yet? That's not too bad. That's, that's more than most people are doing. We don't want Tyson really, though. We want, um... Actually, no, we do want Tyson for a second. We're gonna... We're gonna just, well, I probably should have attacked. Son of a bitch, that's annoying. Oh, that's annoying. Okay. All right. Okay. 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 
So what I want to do is I want to... Tyus, will you stop having the first turn? Oh my god, I know, I know you're fast, but Jesus. He's not that fast in bloody Bloodsport. So what I want to do is I want to haste Oren. So I want to switch in Oren whilst Tyus is on the field so I can haste him. Then we can switch Lulu back in and she'll still be hasted. Switching them out doesn't remove that. It's only when they die. <laughs> Excuse me. Um... I suppose I'll use your own hey, drive. Hey, chill. Billy, thank you so much, dude, for resubscribing nine months in a row. Very kind as always. Eight months, sorry. Thank you, Billy. How are you doing, sir? How was life? Good, sir. Hey, Why B cross A, left, right, A. Breaks my brain every time, man. Okay, 3k damage. I mean, that's something. I keep dark rastering you again. Walker does not have that much mana. He's got a lot more than he used to. Again, blast punch. Doesn't matter. It's just kind of annoying, but doesn't really matter. The lay attack we tried, I think it said it was immune. Pretty sure. Again, if this boss doesn't have a, a an attack that will hit everyone, it basically can't kill me. Thus, I am confused. But I think at this point, I'm going to speed up the battle, because we've sort of, we, we've seen what's happening here. It just seems like it's going to take a while, so let's just make it quicker, right? Yeah, keep doing that shit. Uh, he was immune to power break, right? What about armor break? He's not immune to armor break. Okay, that's good. That's good. It's not going to affect... Uh... Oh, I just remembered what armor break does. It doesn't just lower their defense. It actually removes the ability to need piercing. It's very good for something like this. So now Walker can do full damage, basically. Which might mean, actually, that we should get rid of Lulu. Because now Tyus could probably do full damage as well. Well, he should. There's no reason he shouldn't. Interesting. Most intriguing. Oh my god, with the bloody blast punches. We're all, see, this is my concern. We're all very low on health. Oh dear. Uh, shit. Shit. Uh, shit. How did you get two turns in a row? That's cheating. Okay, you know what? Just keep resin people, man. Just keep resin people. There we go. Don't you do it. Oh, thank you. Yay. Use a mega potion. We have them. They're there to be used. I can't believe we only have one death so far. It's to a bloody Marlboro. I mean, I can believe it's to a bloody Marlboro, but... What a jip. The only thing is, because they died, they're going to be slow now. Oh, it fucking sucks. <laughs> it really sucks. All right, speaking of slow, speed the battle back up. Uh, get Tyus back in. Because, again, he can do full damage. And we want him to haste... Oh, what is the other one slow? Okay, so it's not too bad, because we switched her out. There's a whale away on this wall. Yeah, keep Dark Buster in here. I'm actually going to use another Mega Potion with Titus. Just to, just in case. Because again, I don't think it's going to have a move that's going to hit everyone. But I don't know that for sure. It might just have like some arm sweep where it just wipes us all out. And yeah, I don't want to arrest it. I don't want to arrest that. I don't know when I'll last say. Well, actually, I do know when I'll say. But uh, it's been long enough, you know? God damn it. Uh... Would have been better if Oren went first because we could have rest him with Oren and haste him with Ty. Okay, Ty is dead. Fair enough. Fair enough. This boss is an asshole. Do we use another Mega Potion? That seems like a waste. I think we just use a regular potion. Again, uh, Yuna would be good here, certainly, because we could uh, we could you know protect and what have you, and use life and cure. But that seems like an awful lot of work, you know. Awful low work. Jack, you smack it. Lovely. It's definitely getting low on health. We've been wailing on it for quite a while. Uh, we could summon. You're not wrong. We could do that. Hang on a minute. Do we have any, um... Do we have any summons with overdrives? That's probably nothing we do. Ah, uh, Bahamut's close. Alright, let's try Bahamut then. Here I am to save the day! What up? Rawr, I'm a... Stoky Dragon. Yeah, it's got 4k health left. This might actually kill it. Close! I'm gonna I'm gonna boost. I would like to just kill you with an overdrive to make sure we overkill you. <gasps> you know? I regret that decision. <laughs> Fuck you one shot my Bahama. It's because we boosted so he did extra damage. Walker just walks in and passes out. <laughs> oh, that's funny. 
Well, uh, we... <sighs> hmm. I want to overkill it. I really do. Um... I don't think anyone's going to survive its physical attacks, though. It's going to just one-shot all my bloody summons. Hmm. <laughs> yeah, I don't know how we can overkill this reliably. We kind of can't. We don't really have any overdrafts to use or anything. Yeah. Screw it, I guess. We'll just smack it and kill it. Why does everyone hate 13? Because 13 is dreadful. 13 is just a poor video game. Like, as linear as 10 is, because, you know, 10 is very linear. Oh, good, it's using Mighty Guard now. Can't you lance it, Mighty Guard? Hang on. Probably not from this boss, but I know you can learn it. Yeah, not from the boss, but you can definitely learn that. I killed it. I killed it with lance it. I mean, I'll take it, but, uh, you know, whatever. Take Bango on level 2 key sphere. I'll take it. Yeah, so uh, thirteen is a very uh, ten is a very linear game. Uh, however, thirteen makes ten look like bloody Skyrim by comparison. Like it, it, it is straight path after straight path after straight path. But here's the way it works: you get a really long cutscene where they talk about Lassie and Falsi and Ivalice and all this weird shit that you've never heard of and you don't understand the words. And the cutscenes drag on for a really long time. It's just a bunch of boring characters talking about boring shit to each other. And then after the cutscene, you walk down a really long path. Fire monsters. Straight path. No curves. No nothing. A long path. You finish the path. You get a really long cutscene and a boss fight. You beat the boss. You get another really long cutscene. You go down another long straight path. You get another long cutscene and a boss fight. You go, and, and it's just that again and again and again and again and again. It's so unbelievably dark. Way in? That way leads down into the valley. Wow, you know your way around, yeah? Huh? There's like a rail shooter. Yeah, it's the rail shooter of RPGs. Uh, go under the bridge downtown is where I drew some blood. What? <laughs> what the fuck are you talking about? Yeah, this is, uh, you see on the right, that way, over where she was, that's where you, uh, that's where you go get your Jimbo. Again, I'm not sure if we get your Jimbo, actually, it might be left, it's, it's down here somewhere anyway. Um, either way, I'm not sure if we can get your Jimbo yet. But, uh, maybe we can. Also, I'm pretty sure you can recruit this bitch to a Blitzball team. If not her, someone around here. This land where Lady Yoken, Yoken? Trained is sacred to the Crusaders. Lady Yokan, 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 uh, was a member of the Crusaders before becoming a summoner. Fascinating. Thank you for sharing that. Red Hot Chili Peppers Not under the bridge song. song. Switch on. I mean, I get the Red Hot Chili Peppers reference. I don't know about the Drew some Blood part. Is that from the song as well? I guess it must be. You have poisoned me. How dare you? Hey, me. Take that. Uh, also, I'm, well... How much money do you need for Yojimba? Does anyone happen to know? Or would anyone be willing to look it up? What up, evil Kuma? How's it going? That means bear in Japanese. You know how I know that? Because I've played Tekken. And you play as a bear in Tekken called Kuma. And I always wondered why it was called Kuma. And then one day I was like, oh, it's bear. As, as they just called it bear. Uh, hmm trying to decide if I can be bothered to... Oh, we keep learning stuff. Ow! Trying to decide if I can be bothered to switch around. Well, I, we've already fought this enemy, so... Oh my god, get clubbed. Oh, we should be capturing this. That's a thing we definitely should do. And we don't have a capture weapons on. However, Titus does. You didn't... Excuse me? Excuse, excuse me? You just killed Lula? What are you doing? Stop it! There we go. Alright, we should capture it now. Now. How is it like? I thought it didn't have that much health. What the hell, dude? This thing's tanking everything. God, the capture weapons suck. And again, putting piercing on some of them is definitely a good idea. Oh, hey, there's a robot here. Honestly, kind of forgot this thing was here. <laughs> I was just focused on the other enemy. <laughs> Clobber. Bloody hell. 125 grand? I don't have that much money. Not even close. 
Bloody hell. Can't afford that shit. I got a rusty sword. What's that for? Is that for Yojimbo? Is that something to do with Yojimbo? It's something to do with Yojimbo, isn't it? Uh, let's have a look. Key item, right? An old rusty sword. Accurate. Accurate. Ow. Ow. What's your HP? 8,700. Watch out for the poison. <gasps> really? Never would have guessed. Bonk. Uh, let's get Unirin. I would like not to die. If at all possible. Yo, stop it. Stop it. Just cure these people. Let my people go. Uh, we don't want to kill it is the thing. Because again, we don't have a capture weapon on. Or actually, do we? No, we don't. Alright, put on your capture weapon. There you go. Atta boy. You put on your capture weapon as well. These things are down here bloody everywhere. This might count as part of the Calm Lands, actually. This might be the other enemy that we have not caught yet. It's, I think that might be the case. Wow, our HP, I just realized. I'm using a Mega Potion. Screw that. I'm not dying of these things. We have not saved since the boss. Lest we forget. Uh, Lulu! Does she have the capture weapon on? No, of course not. That would just be convenient. I want to test uh, to see if we do capture them by maging them. Again, I I can't remember, to be honest. I don't think it said we captured that. I probably should slow it down to make sure. But I don't think it did. Ow! Uh, who has not had a go? I don't think you did. Steal from that bitch. Yeah, I got a high potion. Totally worth it. You want to get back in here? You can re Oh my god, you can revive Kamari. Here we go. Smacky, smacky. Oh my god, you did so much damage. It was beautiful. It was beautiful. I don't know how you didn't capture it. Yo. Thank you. Got a banjo. Wait, why did Oren... Did Oren die? Oh, Oren died right at the end of poison. Lame. Lame, you got no XP. Lame. Super lame. Oh my god. So much mana. Hello, sir. Who are you? Hi, Summon of Yoga. I once trained in this land. We Crusaders also intend to train here to challenge Sin once again. Oh, this is the guy that you can hire for Blitzball. I wish you could see their stats in Blitzball, but you just bloody can't. But yeah, that dude is pretty good from what I recall. For what? I don't know. But uh, you want him, probably. Unless you're using the regular dude. So, we don't have enough of the money for Yojimbo. In case you're wondering why that's a thing, uh, you need money for Yojimbo. You'll figure out when we get there. But uh, yeah, just in the meantime, no, that's the, that's the case. I'm gonna aqua breath these dudes. Yeah, take that. Wow, that did nothing. It was awful. That must count as a magic attack. It must be wire. Hmm. Okay. Interesting to know. Interesting to know. Oh, hey, Bahamut, welcome back. You died. He asked for hundreds of thousands of gills, but it's possible to hack. Yes, you can haggle with him, yes. Hey, you, you survived with 81 HP. This is unacceptable. This is not acceptable. Alright, let's capture this bitch. Uh, I will dismiss you. We can save his overdrive for when we need it. Uh, who's going to capture with him? You, you still have Yes, you do. Lovely. Taking the beating of our lives down here. I don't actually... Oh, no, never mind. Ignore everything I was about to say. I forgot there was a save point here. Did I even use this? Oh, I did. Wow, completely forgot that was there. When did you get that summon? What? Bahamut? It was the most recent one we got. We got it, uh... I don't know how to describe it, but yeah, the last temple. That's the biggest pain in the ass temple. I think it's the last one, though. I don't think there's any more. Is there the summons you don't get from Cloister of Trials? The faith is inside. You know, we're like an enemy of the... the religious the fiends. They're not going to be okay with us just walking in a temple. Hey. This where... Hmm. Where? What? The summoner I guarded on my first pilgrimage died here. Wait, yo, Jimbo's the. Wait, what? Apparently, I forgot that. Yuna, let's go. The faith awaits. Well, I guess it's not necessarily Yojimbo, right? Maybe Yojimbo was the one that killed her summoner, but I think what they're alluding to is that Yojimbo is actually her summoner. Like I mentioned. It seems that, uh, people become Aeons. Pretty sure you some levels, I know. 
I know. Hang on, we gotta look around the cave, see if we can find your Jimbo. Uh, okay. That is the thing. Motherfucker. Oh, look, it's these dudes. They're called Valaha. Not Jewelhorn, Valaha. It's an entirely different enemy, everyone. It's probably still gonna breathe fire, but it's an entirely different enemy. Not the same thing at all, and don't you dare claim it is. What's wrong with you? I will capture you. We, we captured him. And then he fucking died. Alright, let's res this bitch. Again, normally I would uh, be inclined to turn the battles off, but since we need to capture them, may as well, right? And it's not like we can't use the, the stats, because we certainly can. We certainly can use the stats. If you come you just need to use Walker, I will dock you. you can, I'm pretty sure, yeah, you can dock it. It didn't say immune. Uh, Lulu. And then, uh, we are very, very close to getting the Argos. Like, we may be able to do it if I just use the speed levels. But that seems like a lot of work. What we should do, though, is turn battles off, go outside, and then go use them. Because honestly, I don't know if we're going to be able to save in there or what. So, I don't want to end up using the sphere levels in the middle of the cave and then dying and having to use them all again. That's why we're doing that, so. Uh, are you interested in Borderlands 3 at all? I mean, honestly... Honestly... Not really. Like... I played Borderlands 2 and I did finish it and I thought it was okay. We need two more. So we need... Uh, yeah, yeah. Two more. Close. I thought it was okay. Um... But it wasn't... It wasn't exactly blowing my mind. Like, it, it, you know, it, it, it's okay. It's not a bad game, but it's just not particularly my game, you know? The Aga spells, yeah. Which is easier than saying, you know, Blizzaga, Farga, Thandaga, Wardaga. Also, Wardaga sounds hilarious. Uh, we will go here first. Oh, we get, uh, we get well. No, 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 no. Almost missed that strength level. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. You gotta be careful about that shit, man. Sometimes you go straight past something. Because you're trying to be fast about it. Give me all that shit. Take that HP, you bitch. Fair change, I think, lets you throw money at people, quite literally. Which is funny that we're getting that now when we're about to throw money at someone. Um, not that we can, because we don't have enough. I think we need, someone said, like, 125 grand or something. We actually did have close to that, but we spent, like, 38 grand on a bloody staff. Well, I guess even then, we would have had, like, what, 90 grand? Yeah. Do it a ways to go on the cash. Uh, but we'll get, you know, it's, it's not going to take that long. Again, it's one of those things, like, later in the game, 125 grand is a pittance. A pittance. You need 200 grand. Well, yes, but you can haggle it down. Uh, they do initially ask for 200 grand. Which you can haggle. But there is only a point to which you can haggle, which I think is 125, someone said. It's something like that. It's not half of what it was, but I think it's close to it. Either way, we don't have half of it. So, uh, but again, my point being that later in the game, 125 grand is extremely easy to come by. Uh, so again, another thing that we want to return for later. But not as later as you might think, you know? Uh, since we are very close to opening up the, you know, the ability to fly where we want with the airship, we will soon have all of the things. There is a luck upgrade here. However, I don't think we have the thing that we need to actually unlock it, do we? Have a look. Uh, that's a big fat no. How the hell do we learn them? Oh, it's a fortune sphere or something, right? Either way, we don't have it. Well, that sucks all the penis. That sucks all of the penis. There's mountains of penis. It's to go. <gasps> Means I don't have to cast it, everyone. It just will. Ah, oh, no, don't do that. Means it will just work. Sell the old gear you want to use. I mean, yeah, I can do that, but we're not going to get... What do we have, like 50 grand? So we need 70... Yeah, about 70 grand. Not going to get 70 grand out of that. Like, not even close. That's the problem. Like, if I thought it would make much of a difference, I would. But most of it's like... Crap, that doesn't sell for much at all. It's going to be like a few hundred apiece. Maybe a couple of thousand. You know? And we don't have that many spare weapons. One more level. There you go. Well, that shit. Going to the Omega Ruins. I can't remember what these ruins are called. Aren't they? Yeah, they might be called Omega Ruins. Uh, Major Defense. Blah, 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 blah. What is that? What is that? Dispel. That would have been handy earlier. Um, I mean, still handy now. What's, what, what is, whose grid is this? Oh, this is also Riku's grid. 
Yeah, we're nowhere near at the end of it. So, uh, Kamari, for whatever reason, his grid is way shorter than everyone else's. Kamari's, like, very not unique in that way. But he makes up for it with the fact that he's the only dude that can lance it. You know? Well, I think you can learn lance it with other people, but the point is, his lance it is the only one that's going to teach him, you know, enemy abilities. No one else can do that, so... In that sense, he's unique, but then again, you could argue that everyone's unique when it comes to their overdrives, because, you know, that's his overdrive, so... Yeah, apart from that, he's just... You kind of just turn him to whoever you want to turn him into, which again, we sort of made him like a second thief. But, to my point, uh, by the end of the game, everyone ends up on everyone else's grid, so they kind of all just become like a jack of all trades. Master of everything. Yeah, uh, no, we haven't got that yet. Uh, we can't, I think. I think we have to get these ones first or something. How does that work with the, the treasure? Do we only have to get the treasure in the Cloister of Trials, or is there like a treasure in, for example, Yojimbo's cave that we have to get? I do not recall. These things are a pain in the frickin' ass. They're just like every other one, they'll just keep putting us to sleep, so... Again, I'm just mostly gonna speed up the combat here. And then you go with a bloody sleep. God. Oh, they blind you as well? Oh, lovely! Oh! Oh, fucking lovely! What an asshole. We didn't capture that, did we? I'm pretty damn sure we didn't. So, yeah, Lulu's not going to be very useful at all for capturing things. That is unfortunate. Yo! Fucking fast are you, my god! Stop it! Yeah, they can easily kill you, as you've seen. They can easily kill you. Because, again, magic attacks do not wake people up. So, they can just wail on you with their magic attacks, and you have to wake up naturally. Or, you know, if a teammate smacks you, but, uh... When everyone's asleep, that ain't gonna happen. Uh, Tyson's is the capture thing. You know the other one that has that turn, I think? Sure, there you go. Stop it! God, you're annoying. Alright, let's Isuna uh, Kamari, because then we'll get rid of his sleep and his darkness. We can keep smacking it with Kamari. Tactics, people, tactics. You know, you can just do it again immediately. Fucking plants. But there's three of them battle. So if you look on the bright side, you've only got to do like three and a bit battles with them. And then you can just not mess around with them after that. Ah, uh, God, okay. Alright, it's fine. Yeah, Ma God, we need another healer, is the thing. Like, we really do. Again, I could turn off battles here, but we gotta capture him. Uh, Kevin of the Stolen Faith. There's a very special mob in here, though. I mean, Dark Yojimbo's here later. But you have to have Yojimbo first, right? Ichiriku healing. Uh, might be able to. I mean, I, well, I guess technically we could teach basically anyone Chura because we have those white magic orbs. So I could teach it to Lulu, for example, which actually is a great idea. Actually, do we have any white magic orbs? If we do, we should do that. Whoa. But I think I was waiting for Kyurga. Uh, which obviously we don't have yet. I cannot be bothered to switch everyone in, so what I'm just going to do instead is just unsternify this bastard. And then smack it. Oh my god. Oh my god. There we go. Uh -huh. There's not many enemies in this Yojimbo cave. There's not that many at all. But they're mostly bastards. They mostly come at night. Mostly. Hey, Mega Alexia, sweet. Have you found the little turtle of doom? Little turtle of doom? In this cave? Is it like a regular enemy? Why do I feel like I, I'm vaguely remembering that now that you're saying it? Oh good, Tyson. Stop! <laughs> Bitch! Alright, it's fine. Unstonify this prick. I'm going to use the overdrive again. Again, one day we'll learn a new bloody overdrive with him. One day. I have faith. Chamber of the Faith. Yeah, is it like a little turtle dude that like cast doom on you or something. I kind of vaguely remember it now that you're saying it. Oh god, what happened? What's a faith doing in a place like this? Don't ask me. They say it was stolen from a temple long ago. Oh, Tonberry? Oh, Tonberries are in here? Oh. With no faith. You call a Tonberry turtle? Train. Without training, they cannot call the final Aeon. It doesn't have a shell. Without the final Aeon, they cannot defeat Sin. 
That is why. Because then the summoner won't die. I will admit, they do look like a Koopa Trooper without a shell, though. Mm. That must be what the thief was thinking. Thief. Blood. Walk one. I kind of agree with him. <laughs> the teeth, exactly, yeah. Don't make me crazy, Kofi. So, for those of you that are experts, I know there's at least a couple here, what's the deal with Yojimbo? If I don't have the money and Yojimbo shows up, do we just miss Yojimbo permanently? Does he fuck us up and kill us? Like, what? what's going to happen here? Well, what happens if I don't have the cash? Because I don't have the cash. We just don't. Are we serious right now? Uh, uh, oh my god. Game, you gotta like stop breaking. No, I wouldn't mind if I'd like pirated this game. But no, I bought this on Steam. This is the Steam version of this game. Like, fix your shit. You can come back. Okay, good. That's what I figured. The later Final Fantasies are a lot less punishing in that way, but you know, in like the earlier Final Fantasies, it would be like, you missed it, bitch. You're never gonna get it again. Lost all the captured enemies. Oh, I know. I know. Believe me. I'm aware of how badly they just fucked me. Didn't even take me out at dinner first. I pressed record on this fucking thing again. My god! Jeez, it just fucking work! Holy shit! Ah, it's deafening every time! What a piece of shit. <sighs> okay. I mean... I was capturing them, yeah. I'm turning battles off now, fuck this. Ooh, okay. Turn battles off now, fuck this shit. I'll do it later. I'll do it later. In my chest. Like sun see you in four days. Yeah, again, uh, if there are Tomberries in here, they're probably going to be kind of rare. That's the only problem with capturing the enemies is like the, the riffraff that are easy to encounter. It's not a problem. But if you're trying to capture something that doesn't show up that often, that's where it becomes a problem. Plus, if it's a Marlboro, you might wait like 15 battles for a Marlboro to show up and then it fucks you up with bad breath. Which is why you kind of want anti bad breath stuff. What that protect bag will do for you. I don't know, where, where did we get it? Was it from that chest? I thought money was in the chest. Did I imagine that? Maybe I imagined money. Uh, who's the bangle person? It's Lulu, right? Yes. Yes, it is. It was metal, wasn't it? Was that a metal bangle we found? Now, either way, we have SOS Protect on this one, which I think basically means if your health falls into the yellow, like the critical, then it will cast Protect on you. Uh, which is not dreadful. I'm really glad I used my uh, sphere levels before fucking around with this. Man, that would have sucked. Did we go this way yet? Oh, we, go, we open this. I think. I can't remember. Well, we open it now. Alright, so we're basically back where we were. Okay, okay. God, this game today. So crashy and buggy. Will someone give the little thief clothes? <laughs> Wait, what? I don't get the reference. What the hell is that? Oh, it's a rock. I thought there was a dude standing there. Look, I'm blind. Fortune Spear? Isn't that the thing for luck that I literally just said we did not have? Uh, let's see if I'm correct. Yep. Alright, well, I guess we'll use it. Ain't that fortunate? Oh, for, it was, it was, it was, for, you might say it was lucky. You might say it was lucky that we acquired one then. You might, you might say it was lucky. All right. This is the useless mascot. Yeah, pretty much. Mega potion. <gasps> now, big primer, just here in a cave, rambling in the corner. Oh, take it. Oh, hey, they let you save before your Jimbo, because I'm pretty sure your Jimbo's right through here. Let's see if he murders me. I think he's just like, nah, piss off. Come back with more money. Pat, another Guado fiend? No, an unsent. No. 
Good morning. You look like Belgiamini. No, I'm not. But you look like her. It is. It's you, is it not? So are you Yo Jimbo? I don't remember. Forgive me. I was too young. Colors, what the hell? So Lulu's hair is flipping out. There is no human left in you now, is there? Very well then. Allow me to perform my last duty to you, my last as your guardian. Are you Yojimbo? Or did she summon Yojimbo? Like, what's going on here? I'm very confused. This is Yojimbo. Well, this. He's a samurai. Yeah, okay, so she's not him. She, for some reason, is a, an unsent who summons him? It's weird. Uh. Yeah, so basically. I can't remember how the shit you do this. But you have to offer Yojimbo money for its services. And apparently he requests 200,000. We may have to beat him first, I can't remember. I say we beat his ass, because I see no option here to give him money. Um, but yeah, anyway. Point being... We're going to need about 125,000. We don't have that, so we're not going to work. We got Rodiga! Rodiga! For the dog first. Oh yeah, there is a dog. I forgot it. I forgot Yojimbo has a dog. Can I take the dog? I cannot. Never mind then. Honk. Diagoro. Ow. That hurt. Music's very pretty. Use Demi. Demi might work. I'll try. Kinda doubt it though. He seems to be armored as well. Bastard. Black magic. I really doubt it'll work. Every time, man. Every time. Uh, put the piercing tube back I forgot what I was going to say. Like, I had a point to make. What was my point? I, I had a point. Well, anyway, again, we don't have the cash. So, but I don't see an option here to give him cash. So maybe we have to beat him first and then you can offer him money, I guess, maybe. Ow. I do not know. Okay, someone's going quick as hell. Stop it. He's obviously going to kill us. What? Okay, so. For those that don't know. His overdrive that you see filling up there, uh, it, it will one-shot us. It's like he cuts us in half, straight up. It's brutal. Um, so you, it's a time fight, basically. we got to kill him before he kills us. In case you're wondering what the deal is with it. That is insta-death to everyone. No, no, we got this shit. Don't you worry. A delay buster his ass. Okay, it doesn't work. Who shame on me. Touché. However, you might be able to summon an Aeon to tank it. You might just cut the Aeon in half instead. So, worth noting if we need to. Summon when he uses an overdrive. Exactly. That might work. Hopefully we don't have to. He's got nothing? For a man who wants... Well, actually, that explains why he wants money. Suddenly it makes sense. It's stop. Stop it. Stop it right now. White magic. Life. Wait, what? What the hell happened here? Stop dying, Lulu. The dog is mauling the shit out of her. Okay, don't attack Lulu. Why is with this dog attacking Lulu? Okay, hang on. Hang on. Yeah! Super team. Um, I kind of don't want you in, though. No offense. Should probably use break on him, actually. Uh, you... What was Watergar doing? Let's check. I'm doing about one and a half thousand with everyone else. Okay, so significantly better. So yes, we'll keep her in. Don't attack her again. What the fuck? Seriously? What the hell? Why? Why are you doing this? What is it about Lulu that that dog friggin' hates? You got something against boobs? What's your problem? 
you anti-feminist. I should have hasted again. I forgot that Auron wasn't hasted. Please, please no, Lulu. Do his dog here. Yeah. Hey, thanks. Thank you. Appreciate it. Power break? Can I power break you? Down it. Yeah, I think so. All right. We haste Auron. May want to whip out a potion here. Not right now, though, but, yeah. Oops. Uh, not right now, but, um, may want to think about it. I was gonna say he's got to be low. We're doing a lot of damage, at least, at least with Lulu. The rest of them not so much, but Lulu's just kicking up. Okay, uh, now we may want to cure Lulu. Yeah, I'm just gonna pop a Mega Potion. We got plenty of them. No more though. That's our ration for today. No more. Stop it. No more Mega Potions. It's immune to everything. Basically, yeah. Summons usually are. In fact, they may always be. I don't think you can status effect any summon. Armor break, though, actually, again, probably will work. Because he seems to be armored. The music is so good, dude. Straight up. Yeah, he's low health, which is why he's, like, fallen to one knee. We're definitely going to kill him before his overdrive. Like, I am confident of that. Try the arm break. Fuck. Nope, he's immune. All right, suck a nut then. Suck a nut. Dude, Lulu's got so much magic as well. Like MP. I think he's dead. Nope. He was dagoring me. Bastard. Uh. Yeah, I'm gonna cheer. I don't know why. I should have done this earlier. Actually, like really early on in the fight, would have stopped Lulu dying so much. But meh, meh. There we go. He's down. You suck. You're terrible. Why would I want to pay for your services after that shit? I wish you could get the Dark Aeons. Even if it was just like a reskin for your existing Aeons, because a lot of them look so much cooler. Maybe they excuse me. Like Dark Yojimbo looks cool as shit. Strange. Dark Bahama. I thought it would be sadder somehow. Cool as shit. Maybe I've gotten used to farewells. You're stronger now. Waka. I hope you're right. <sighs> Yuna, the faith is inside. Go do what you came to do. <laughs> you came to give it a shitload of money. <laughs> uh, this, I guess, is just a teleport out, I suppose. I do not. Wait, 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 wait. Okay, no, never mind. It teleports us left and right. And also up. Up is the Chamber of the Faith, where Yojimbo is. This is just chests in a room? How very random. MP Sphere? Don't mind if I do. HP? No, X Potion. That's okay. That's acceptable. They're kind of random. Kind of random. Let's go this way. Give me all of the things. Yeah, ha ha ha. Flexible arm! <laughs> uh, who's using the flexible arm? <laughs> uh, sorry, masturbation. Uh, wait, what is it? Is it a key item? Where the hell is it? Dude, I don't know where it is. Straight up, I have no idea. Um... What? Where'd it go? Oh, okay, so it probably went in a gap that I made... Oh, that's really annoying. Um, let's auto-sort it and see if it's like... I don't know where it is. Oh, that's irritating. Uh, flexible arm. Flex flexible arm. I have a flexible arm. Where would I be? Wait, this is... It's not my equipment. God damn it. Uh, auto? And then... That ma ma manual? Flexible. Does anyone know who it's for? I legit have no idea. You'd think it would be on the arm guard? But it's not? Who the bloody hell is using a flexible arm? <laughs> oh, there it is. Oh, it's for her. Oh, right. Okay. It's for Riku. Wait. No, not Riku. 
Wait, no, it is right. It's a Riku weapon. Okay. That was confusing. Uh, yeah, so it's just, it's a completely empty weapon with four slots. Again, seems like total shit. But when you are later in the game, you have a lot of, you know, items, or at least the ability to farm them from bosses and whatnot and that you can make in, um, you know, the place with the thing and the stuff uh, in the arena, then you can uh, customize it however you want. You can make it pretty good. However, again, once you have the celestial weapons, they become not useless, but you can make good capture weapons with them, but that's about it. Oh good, that thing just fucking destroyed me in a single hit. Thank you for that. I'm going to outside the save, by the way, in case you're wondering what I'm doing. Uh, because I don't wish to fuck up this Yojimbo thing if we can, and I'm not sure that we can't. I was told we can't, but you never know. Take that, you nidhog bitch. Uh, we unfortunately killed it, which is a little annoying. Gotta be honest, it's a little bit annoying. Kind of wanted to capture that. Uh, impulse. Boop. Wow, 300 damage. Nice. Lovely. Quality stuff right there. They got 1,500 health. That is 300. That's really bad. Jesus Christ. Alright, they're kicking the shit out of Bahamut as well. Alright, what element are we? We don't know. Because, of course, no one's got bloody sensor. Doesn't Kamari have sensor? Alright, so we smack of the Kamari. That was a crit? My god! We got a giant pain in the dick to capture. Alright, what element were they again? Were they any element? No, they're non elemental. But they're also reflected. Oh, that's irritating. Oh, that's irritating. Uh, the other one didn't reflect, though, I don't think. This one. I think it was just the first one. No, it's reflected. And I killed myself. Alright, nice. Well done there. <laughs> yeah, you might be able to tell some of the enemies in this cave are a pain in the ass. They're just the same reskin shit, but at least they fight differently. Hmm. Oh god. Yeah, they're even smart enough to cast the spells on themselves, so that they, you know, if you reflect, you can't just reflect it straight back. They even cast their own spells on themselves. What a bunch of dicks. There. 186 damage. Yeah, I know we can. I know we can dispel it. I know. It doesn't do me a world of good, to be honest. Because again, I kind of want to capture it, but just so we Let's don't bloody die, I'll pressure. get rid of this one. Again, these. This is the sort of thing where it's like mm, we should come back here when we're stronger. Because if you're struggling to even kill the enemies, capturing them is probably not a great idea at the time. Because obviously your capture weapons are weaker, and you're concentrating on capturing them instead of cat, you know, killing them, etc., etc. You get the idea. You get the idea. I mean, they were kicking the crap out of my summon. Like, what do you want from me? Who's Ixion? Eh. Eh. Ixion's quick as shit. <laughs> it killed me. <laughs> you muppet. Oh, that's funny. Yeah, okay, how about you stop doing the things that don't heal me? Thank you. Thank you for dying. I just want to go outside. I just want to say. That's all I want to do. Make it to the save point without a battle. Let's go. Okay. Fantastic. Now let's go have a look. I'm actually going to turn battles off. I just didn't want to really cheat there and turn battles off whilst we were escaping. Felt like cheating. Uh, but yeah, anyway, we'll turn battles off so we can come in here uninterrupted. Go see what's going on with your Jimbo. But again, I'm pretty sure it's just going to be like, hey, do you have enough money? No, piss off. Oh, we'll see. Bum, ba, bum, ba, bum, 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 bum. Oh, look, you can see the sword. It's a pretty cool grave. I guess it's a grave. And I suppose your Jimbo was probably one of her guardians. But they never specifically said that. But your Jimbo was working for her. You know, they were together. Oh, oh, hey, oh. Yeah, that's the way he looks like as a human. Summoner, I ask you, what do you want of me? Correct me if I'm wrong, but I think Yojimbo is actually from either mythology or like he was a, a famous samurai in history or something. I can't recall exactly, but I'm gonna Google it right now to check because I want to know. 
Uh, the turn is the sum of the game, the power to destroy fiends to defeat the most powerful enemies. I don't know what you're supposed to say if it even matters. It might reflect the price. Actually, I think these questions reflect the starting price, actually. I think if you give him the right answers, it costs you less to, to recruit him. Um, yo, Jimbo. I'm also going to see if there's a, a way of getting him very cheap, but I'm probably wrong. There is a 1961 film called Yo, Jimbo. Uh, surprisingly, about a samurai. Uh, a nameless ronin or samurai with no master, Toshiro Mifune, enters a small village in feudal Japan where two rival businessmen are struggling to uh, for control of the local gambling trade. Take the name. Okay. Blah, blah, blah. Uh, Yojimbo film. Yojimbo 1961. Yep. Probably named after this movie. That seems to be the case. All right. Anyway. So Yojimbo. Oh, there's a 10. Okay. Let's see if we can... Uh, Let's see if we can uh, get him cheap, but again, I doubt it. 100k probably is cheap. Gavin of the Stolen Faith. Oh, those magic pots thing. Those magic pots things. Those magic pot things are in here. All right, so uh, st choose the third option to defeat the most powerful enemies, as this will reduce the overall cost of your Jimbo in terms of gil. Price starts at 250,000 gil, but you can haggle up to three times by offering your Jimbo less money. You must offer him at least 50% of what he is offering plus one to get him to lower his price. So... Hmm. Yay. Yeah, it does seem like 112,501 is about as cheap as we can get him. If you desire my strength, you must pay my price. Make your offer. Oh well, yeah, isn't this where he just keeps going, do we have a deal? Or is that from something else? How do I, what? Oh, uh, so he wants 250 grand because he's a shit. So we apparently have to offer him half of it plus one. We don't have this much money. I don't even know why I'm fucking with this. But, <laughs> whatever. Uh, wait, no, 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 no. That's the wrong column. That is the wrong column. Uh, yeah, so we ha that's the least we can offer him. God fucking damn it. Not enough gil. Yeah, I know. <laughs> I'll give you... I'll give you 54 grand. 500... A 53. You can't haggle with me on that. It's all my money. That's all I got. Uh, make an offer, I guess? You expect a phoenix, yet you offer chicken feed. Wow. No deal. Maybe next time. Dick. Yeah, we can't afford him. Like I said, we c I, I knew we couldn't afford him. I don't know why I tried, but there you go. <laughs> what a bastard. All right, yeah. So again, I uh, need more money for that. Need more money. But again, 70 grand won't take that long. It won't. Alright, I feel like playing Blitzball. I don't know about you, but we're going to play Blitzball. Um, make sure we save. Make sure we bloody save. Man, my nose today. Good lord. Okay. Excuse me. So... What we're going to do here is uh, essentially the equivalent of soft resetting. So when we find a tournament, but it does not have a prize that we want in either first, second, or third. How does this work? Do, how do the tournaments showing up work? Do I have to play league matches until tournaments show up? How does, how does that work? Can I just keep cancelling and reloading it? I don't recall how the hell it works. Uh, but anyway... When we eventually get a tournament, if it's not what we want in terms of prizes, we're going to do like a soft reset. Because I think that's how it works. Go flog a load of shit. Uh, as you have a load of shit. Eloquent as always, Simon. Um, well. Again, you're not necessarily wrong. We do have extra st stuff. And I'll, sure, I'll sell it. But it's not going to be 70 grand. Like, it's not. Watch it now be like way more than 70 grand. But I really doubt it will be. Uh, but sure. May as well. Just in case. Well, at least that way we have a, a better accurate number for how much we do actually need. A better accurate number. You know what? That was better English than him, so I'll go with it. <laughs> Alright, so. Let's chat with this bastard. I think, he, I think he has a shop, right? I can't even click on the guy. 
Don't worry, good looking fun. We can be in there by to go searching all the rest. Uh, I like some items, you bitch of ball. Sell, okay. And we did organize it. Oh, I can't sell him weapons. Oh. Oh, oh I've got to go to the other person. Oh, son of a bitch. Oh, so oh wait, no, 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 you do have weapons. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's got weapons list. I think you have to use a soft reset on the game, not just come out of Blitzball. You might be right. You might be entirely right. Yay. Yay, Pilgrim. Alright, one grand. Not long now. Uh, Sonic Steel gives us first strike. I don't care about that anymore, so we're going to get rid of it. I don't care about this either. Baduk. Yeah, this is what I mean. Like, most of these are really kind of cheap. Aiming, so yeah, we only need that. Uh, long sword, yeah, no, kind of 12 gold, no even worth me clicking, quite frankly. Not even worth me clicking. Yeah, did you see it? Like, so, it's so cheap. It's just disgusting. And the things that are expensive is like we want. <laughs> like, like, we want the rune rod. That's, that's our best weapon, or whatever it, rod it was called, seeker or whatever. That thing. Again, we really don't really get rid of most of this because it's um it's stuff we need. Twelve gold is something, something, saying. It's, it's shit. It's shit. Glorious. Yeah, it's a bit like Buster. I mean, that one's got Death Touch on it, so again, do we really want to get rid of that? Because that could be very handy. My like Lance, Old Bird. Magic plus 20, again, if we do magic stuff, that's going to be good. Taming one we need to keep. Science proof is also great, which is why it costs 7 bloody grand. Like, generally, if they have a price, that means they're good. And if they don't have a price, they're shit. And if they're shit, why do you even... Why would you even sell it, you know? It is a predicament. See, like, this one's not a big of a deal. We can afford to sell that. But again, that one's not that big of a deal. So we made precisely dick. That's why I thought. Exactly what I thought. Mm -hmm, sure. Make your fence stone wall. Make your fence stone wall. Yeah, we, like, we didn't make much, did we? Uh, first strike. Mm, oh, it's fire strike. Hot knuckles, jiggers and Z. I got a, why is that so expensive? I'm selling the flexible arm. We can always buy them back later. I want the money. All right, so that was one thing worth selling. The rest of it, not really. I'll be honest. So we now we still need the what? Thirty grand? About thirty grand. That's still quite a bit of cash. It's a lot less than uh, seventy, but it's still quite a bit. How much do I bet potion still for? Good question. I think it's like a thousand each or something. I think it's quite a bit, but... Well, they're easy enough to farm, aren't they? Uh, I like items. Again, they might be about the only thing we have worth selling. What do they sell for? 250. That's not much. We might be able to get 30 grand out of it, though. Oh, we totally can. Well, almost. I'm mean, actually get. We're gonna keep some Albert potions. Let's be smart about this. We keep like 15. How much money do we have now? 115,000. We need 10,000 more. We could do this, but we may have to get rid of a couple of things that I don't really want to get rid of, but we can do it. Like, grenades are possible. What about spears? So, for one. Yeah, okay. That's kind of like that. Huh. Hmm. 100, like, okay. Uh, return. Not worth anything. What's the map sell for? 12 gold. Musk. There seems to be some use for this. Okay. No idea what the hell that's for. Hmm. The curtains are worth jack shit. Smoke bombs. Not worth that much. Yeah, I think grenades might be our best bet here. What about remedies? 375. It's, it's quite a lot, but remedies are also very, very valuable. Mega potions also very valuable. X potions also very valuable. Uh, mega elixirs sell for five grand. I'm gonna, I'm willing to get rid of two mega elixirs. All right, we now have enough money. I'm not happy about selling the mega elixirs, but I did it. All right, but let's go get us a bloody Yojimbo, shall we? Again, 
assuming we can haggle him down all the way, and I think we've done it correctly. I hope us not giving him enough money didn't, like, insult him to the point where he's going to ask for more. But you know what? I kind of wouldn't be surprised. I wouldn't be surprised if he's like, I want 300 grand now. And it's like, oh, well, we're fucked, aren't we? But maybe we can still haggle him down to the same if he starts from higher or something? I don't really know. I don't really know. To the Cavern of the Faith, or the Chamber of the Faith, or whatever the bloody hell it said. Eh. <laughs> I don't know why the statue of the arena moves. No, I've no, I've, I've no clue what that's about. Just a weird thing, I think. Your home Oh, that's a good stretch. Oh my god. Okay. If you desire my strength, you must pay my price. Yeah, yeah, I got it, man. Make your offer. Do we have a deal? So we're gonna haggle him down. Um, but he's he's not just gonna be like, yeah, I accept, right? Like, it's, it's not gonna happen. Surely he's gonna go up from there, right? Is that not how it's gonna happen? I don't know. We'll try. Do we have a deal? That's why I thought he's still haggling. The so 22 5th, oh god. So we're gonna half his bloody offer every time until we get down to approximately that number. I think. Though, I, again, I, it seems like he doesn't really go below 2. I, I can't remember. I don't know. We'll see what happens. Um, 22,500 would be 112,501. I think. Am I doing that correctly? I think I fucked it up. Actually, no, I think it's great. Do we have a deal? God damn it, Joe Jimbo. Just, just set my fucking offer. What if I keep offering the same, actually? In a minute. Does that work? Can, can I just keep doing that? Actually, that probably won't maximize it, will it? Well, we'll try. No deal. You bag of dicks! Okay, how do we get your Jimbo? I don't understand. <laughs> I thought... I thought we just gave her the money and he was like... Oh my god, right, hang on. Let me look this up. Yo ho me no. Hiring yo Jimbo. What's the minimum? 200k is the minimum. Oh. If you desire my okay. strength, you must pay my price. Make your offer. Okay, so the minimum is about 200k. That's what I thought. It's not 125 grand, it's 200k. It's just that you can offer him half of what he starts at, so you can offer him 125 grand. So, we cannot possibly get him for what we currently have. Yes, it's about 190,000, but still, it's way more than 125 we have. So we fucked. Basically, we fucked. Do we? No. We do not have deal. Do we have a deal? No. No. Yeah. You can you can just about sneak him under the, the two hundred grand mark, but we don't have two hundred grand. So again, selling selling our stuff wasn't good. Who are you? Can I help you? Isn't this something to do with Dark Yojimbo? Isn't this Dark Yojimbo? This is Dark Yojimbo. What the fuck? I don't even have Yojimbo! Why is Dark Yojimbo here? Uh, 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 I'm leaving. I'm leaving. See you, suckers. Why is he there? I thought he couldn't show up until you... I thought you could not get a Dark Aeon shop until you had the original one. Can we save it and just go back in and will he still be there? I, I need to make sure I don't fuck up this Dark Jimbo fight or something. I don't think you can, but... I'm gonna make a new save so we can go check. I don't think I've ever seen that happen. I may be wrong, but I'm pretty sure I've never seen that thing show up before you got the original. Again, I thought you had to be able to control the airship before Dark Aeons even showed up. If that's the case, then... We could probably go fight, like, Dark Ifrit or something in the Albed Desert. But again, we... We can't necessarily fly there yet. But soon. 
I think we just have to finish Gagazette. I think. Which we're at the bottom of now. If you Your dream ball. You yeah, I don't have the money, man. Give you a, a grand. You expect a okay, and that insulted him. Fuck off then. I'm just trying to see if Yo Jimbo and, and, and Ko are back here. Oh, they pissed off. Oh, they're back again. Hmm. Okay, so they just, just pop up. Not very random. I didn't think... I'm going to look this up as well. I'm learning all sorts of things today. I mean, maybe they changed it. I don't know. Dark Yo Jimbo. Whoa, 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 stop running. Talking Yojimo can be fought only four times instead of five, as the third encounter can be skipped and moved to the fourth area. You have to fight him a bunch of times? Oh. I don't remember that part. I thought you fought him once. I don't remember that at all. Hmm. Well, you know what? Just because, uh, let's, let's go find Guess what? It won't work. He will absolutely destroy me. Oh, good. I've been ambushed. I don't know how that works. Hey, we're dead. <laughs> I thought I thought you might want to see that. So yeah, that's that's why we can't find him yet. He he might just be just just a tad overpowered for us right now. Like we just, might just be just just a smidge underleveled. Holy shit! Just fucking max damaged everyone with one attack. It's ridiculous. Anyway, yeah. We, we can't find him right now. Uh, play baseball. I think you have to have the tournament show up. And then once the, you know the tournament shows up, then you can soft reset. Let's try doing the league in the meantime. I don't... Oh, god damn. I don't want that. I don't necessarily know if that's accurate. But it might be. We want Walker there. That who... Oh my god, I keep fucking... <laughs> I don't want Dado in my formation. Get him out of here, man. Oh my god. Oh, are you kidding me? Holy shit. Alright, you know what? Slow down here, son. Slow down. I keep thinking you have to scroll past the people that are grayed out, but you don't. So I keep scrolling too far. Or well, not far enough. Alright, what do you have? You ain't got anything. Nice. Nice. <gasps> He's got gold now. Why are you why have you not got this equipped? Yeah. What does it do? We should read the description of that. Again, I'm pretty sure I know what it does, but. Uh we should make sure. Wait. How do I... How do I see the description of something when I have it equipped? It's not in the list anymore. I guess you can't? And I have to unequip it, but I don't have anything I'm equip it with, so it just... Okay. Weird. Weird game design decision. Uh, fat ass keep ass still has nothing. Nice. You can recruit Riku's brother. You can indeed, yes. His name is brother. He's pretty good. I think he's a good goalie and a good striker from what I recall. And when I say pretty good, I mean like bloody overpowered. Like, I seem to remember he gets, like, max shot or something. Like, 99 or something ridiculous like that. Whatever the max is. Oh, good, we're against the Luka Goas. I didn't realize that. Great. Just great. Then again, Abs. Old Abs is, uh, dreadful. I call him Abs because he has Abs, and his name is, like, Abs. Give me a walk of some XPs. So he's kind of surrounded there. Yeah, actually, let's dribble for a moment. I would like to get Walker out of there. You have a lot of attack. You also have a lot of block, but I have a decent pass. Just trying to pass it past you. Uh, I think we should be good. As long as this person doesn't get really lucky. Drop tech. What do you mean, drop tech? Talking about buddy? Oh no. Oh no. Okay, we're good. I will go for a shot from here. Oh, shit. I thought I broke them. Oh, god damn. I thought I broke them. Oh, that's irritating. Well, yeah, that was a waste. Uh, drop tech to unequip. Ah, oh, okay. It's fine. I think Golden Arm just, uh... What does it do? Oh, that's what it does. You see how when you are throwing a pass, the, the actual power of the pass ticks down really quick? Golden Arm means it ticks down really slowly. Like, really slowly. So you can make way longer passes. 
That's what it does. I can't remember if it activates every time. I think it does. I think it's just like a permanent passive thing. See? He wishes he had golden arm. Yo, you fumbled it to your teammate? Bullshit. Bullshit. Rigged. I call shenanigans. Oh my god. I see so dreadful attack like people. Oh, and again, she's not trying to... What? It's... Yep, still still dreadful. Still dreadful. Yep. I like how guys get up. It's very cyberpunky. You can do it. I can't. I'm going to smash these fools. I'm going to blow my nose first, though. Oh, no, Momento. Oh, man, that's better. All right, uh, Venom Tackle. I love the animation on that, the way he's sort of like... Almost does like a handstand. I mean, it's not because he's in water, but you know what I mean. It looks like a handstand. Is that Walker right next to me? Walker, get the hell out of here. I have four encounter? It's never going to work. It's never going to work. It's never going to work. This ain't even going to work. It worked! Oh my god, the graves! Oh, come on. All right, just, just get... Just don't get lucky on this tackle, that's all I ask. Well, I, I mean, to be fair, he didn't necessarily get lucky. Basically, what I meant was, get unlucky by, like, at least one. Which, uh, I mean, you know, too much to ask for, I guess. So I can't really complain about it. This guy has a proper bowl haircut. Get out of here, bowl job. My god, he's fast as shit! Is he shooting from there? Oh, he's passing, okay. Jesus Christ, bowl job is fast as hell. There's a guy we gotta worry about. Again... He's kind of slow, really not good when he's attacking you, but his shot is very high. And his encounter is quite good as well. It's just hard to get the ball off of him, and it's hard to save the ball. Especially with Keeper, who is dreadful at, uh, you know, catching goals. At least for half the bloody time until he levels up. Yeah! Uh, okay, we got... Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no! Oh, shit. All right, we may be able to just about do this. No, don't drain tackle me. <gasps> I got one defense left. Okay, underwater. Eh. You suck. Get poisoned. What? That didn't make it? How much of that ball did he get? Oh my god. I wasn't even looking at the numbers. I was like, oh no, that's 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 a surefire thing. Nope. Take that, you bitch. Go, 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 go. Walker, you're supposed to be further forward. What are you doing, son? What kind of striker are you? Walker? What are you, what are you doing? Walker! He's so surrounded! I'm passing it. I, I want the goal. We're passing it, Titus. We've got, like, no time anyway. I might just about have enough time to do a jet shot. Maybe. No break. Shoot. Jet shot. Uh, we do have time if this guy doesn't get, like, a super goalie or something. Oh, man. It's going to be close. Whoa, 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 two seconds left. AKA one second left. Because every two seconds is one second in real life. Yeah, fuck. Okay, so we got we got up a point. So we can uh, more comfortably work on getting some Walker, some Walker EXP in the next half. Again, yeah, we're just doing this to kill time until the tournament starts. I think this is the way it works. I think you have to play games until the tournament begins. But when a tournament is actually active, that's when you can soft reset. As long as you haven't begun the tournament, I think. And then if I'm correct, that's when the, the prizes will reset, when you restart the game. But I think he's correct. I think you do have to full-on restart the game, not just, like, come in and out of the blitzball thing. It doesn't take long. It takes, like, 20 seconds to restart, so it's not the end of the world. I mean, it can take long if you, uh, if you don't get what you're looking for when you reset. That's the problem. You're sh This man's crazy. He's actually insane. He's probably never going to get past Titus. You got tackled by Titus. No one gets tackled by Titus. What are you doing? You just... You're dreadful. Alright, Walker's actually in a pretty good position there. Well, a decent position. I don't know if I would say that's good. Walker... Not Walker. Titus even looks weird when he's passing the ball. He just looks like he doesn't know how to pass. He's got like a, a wonky animation. We gotta hope. We gotta hope. We can't really... Yeah, we can't just shoot... Oh, great. Oh, great. Awesome. 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 At least they didn't wither my shot. They just withered his pass. And Walker's going to be a bitch to level up, especially against the Luka Goas. It's going to be easier on, you know, like Ronso and what have you. He's probably...
probably not gonna make it. Oh, it might. No, 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 no. Yep, not even close. Give me the ball. Hooray! <laughs> Leave me alone. Just trying to get it to the ginger guy. That that walker all the way down there, I hope so. I'll break you. This should make it. Please stop withering my thing. This should make it, but it's quite a long pass. It's probably not going to make it as much as you would think. Seven, six, five, four. Yeah, okay. Comfortably enough. No, no. Ah, oh, I didn't want two people. Oh, fuck me. Uh. Oh, God. Well, okay. We just got to hope this guy misses the ball. Okay, never mind. He took the ball straight from me. Well, that sucks. Man, Luke goes are a pain in the ass. Stop it. Bum, bum, bum. Oh great, he's uh, he's not like open, but he's kind of open. This dude is not tackling him, put it that way. He's passing. <gasps> he fucking tackled him! Oh my god. Letty, Jasu even, sorry. Got your name wrong? You're, you're, you're the king. <gasps> Walker's in a great position. Oh no, this guy's gonna fuck me up. Yes! Okay. Think, think we stay a good chance for once we walk up. Again, though, we do have someone next to us. We just need to, like, not get taken out by them. That's all we need. But they do have Wither Tackle, I think. And they even have more Tackle than we have Defense. So we, yeah, okay. Is this is this Defender? They're fucking us up every time. It's, they, they half my encounter as well. So that... That's bad. <laughs> that's not good. Excuse me, sir. I mean, ma'am. Go away. I got it. I'm to try to shoot with this fucker. Get away, Walker. You're not doing the job properly. I'll do it. Fuck it. Oh, really? Two of you? Jesus Christ. I'm gonna break them both. F it. Okay, you know what? I don't work at all. But they haven't scored. We actually stand a chance of getting the ball with Walker. Oh, come on, Titus. She did like one damage, dude. You did one. If you did one more, Walker would have had it. You suck. Walker would have had it in the goal mouth. God, Titus, bastard. I hate you so much. Oh, way to just like smack my dude in the back of the head with it. He's so quick. Old job's fast as lightning. Uh, oh, he's passing. That, that is irritating. You survive with one. Okay, this guy's got 10 shots. It's not that much. He's really slow. Good lord. I feel like I remember Nidus for some reason. I don't know why. I don't know why he sticks out in my mind. Maybe he gets really good at something? It's, uh, it's not what he's currently doing. Is this Walker next to me? Why are you always in such a shit position, Walker? Oh, god. Great. Oh, awesome. Awesome. Thank you. I mean, there was no chance of us surviving that, but I didn't really have much of a choice. Yo, this person's quick as hell as well. Hey! Right, Walker, go to the gold mouth, sir. You are no... You're literally in defense, man. You're the striker. Oh, we got a time now anyway. God, Walker, you're the worst. There's like three freaking people. Yeah, you're fired. Actually fired. Hey, it's extremely unlikely. Yeah, we're good. Oh, they're going for it with the second left. You're, dri you're dribbling. You're, you're, dri you're dribbling. All right. I mean, I'll take it. Hey, we won. Uh, did Walker get any XP? Not really. No. Oof. Rough. It's rough stuff. Hey, keep his catch one up. Nice. Right, they rehire that dude. Don't really care. Okay, Paso. We come out of this. Make sure we save before. I think you have to save before you check the tournament. You know what I mean? Like, I think by the time you've seen the prizes, they're locked in, so you can't like soft reset after that. I think that's the way it works. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Don't really want any of that. That's actually quite crap. And yes, you can actually reset like everyone. We'll play daily abilities. We reset. Blah blah. blah. 
I think that you, I think that's for every single team. So you just like start fresh in Blitzball if you want, which is kind of cool. I'm not gonna do that, but it's kind of cool. Uh, do we soft reset? Let's see if I can remember how to do that. Okay. Oh, son of a bitch. I have to reset this recording every time, which means uh, I need to figure out a better way of recording this for YouTube because that is a pain in the ass, man. That is a pain in the ass. <laughs> No, not the order save. Jesus. Yeah. Can't really remember what it was. It was like an underdog secret, a potion or something, and then like a speed sphere? Which wouldn't be bad, to be honest. But... Yeah, okay, so they have changed. So... Alexia... Like, what backwards prizes... You didn't look at the 20 prizes, that was league prizes. Oh, was it? Okay. Well, either way. My bad. Um, but they're exactly the same. Uh, which makes sense, actually. Because, uh, yeah, the league hasn't finished. But anyway, so, regen is an ability. However, I can't remember if it's a key ability for any of our people. Will this show me? It does, actually. Okay, so we can check here. No, I don't care about that. I just want to see if anyone needs regen. If no one does, then we're not going to worry about it. I mean, it'd be nice to get, right? Because, like, we, we lack abilities in general, but... I don't think regen's great, to be honest. So I'm not really going to worry about, like, getting third place to get regen. I maybe still should. But it seems like a lot of work for something that's kind of... average, you know? Ah, uh, yeah, no one needs it. So it's not a key technique. So I am just going to say F that, and we're going to stop reset. Bum -bum. It was a good idea for Morty Saved. I had many times your younger brother saved all your FF work. Yeah. I mean, I do have multiple saves, but I usually double them up at the end of the stream. But I have done it a couple of times during, like, midstream. But yes, you're not wrong. It is a good idea. I mean, worst case scenario is you just have to, you have to do, like, another tournament. You know? Uh, if you accidentally lock in the prizes. It's not the end of the world. It's like three matches or something. Wait, they're the same? Are you fucking kidding me? So what am I doing wrong here? Because I definitely didn't check them. I definitely didn't check them before I... Have they, have they fixed that or something? Maybe they changed it so that you can't soft reset anymore. It's possible you just can't do that on this version. Highly possible. I don't know why they would fix that, but... Pretty sure I'm doing it correctly. And the chances of those being the exact same prizes seems like a million to one. Maybe we'll have to go for that region, which I think means we have to win like one match and then lose the rest to come third or something. Something like that. Oh no. Let's double check. They're the same. Alright, don't know what's up with that. I guess we'll have to go for the region then. Again, correct me if I'm wrong, I think we have to win one, then lose the rest. I think. What a bunch of shit. What a bunch of absolute bulls. Do you remember you just reset the game until a tournament shows up, you don't need to wait for one, and then... Oh, you may be right. You may be right. We'll figure it out. Again, it's possible they've changed it so you just can't do that anymore, but I don't know why they would. I don't know why they've got that way to do that. But you never know. Maybe they did. Take that, you ginger prick. Thank you. Oh god, my throat is hurting. God, I hope I'm not getting sick. Yo, fuck out of here. That's all the talking. You know what? This is probably true. Oh my god. Yeah. <laughs> Stop. Stop it. Is this the dude that's fast as hell? One of the Guados, I'm sure, is absolutely insanely quick. Okay, I don't think it's him. Actually, no, he... He kind of has, like, a weird slow animation, and yet he's moving quite fast. I think it's him. Alright, we got the boys. Is that Walker over there? Jesus, they're all quick as hell! Yeah, I think it's Zazzy. I think it's the blonde dude. This one, I think. I don't know. Uh, we can break those easily. Easily. 
Yeah, you go, Shelton Benjamin. All right, pass that in to Walker. We will no doubt disappoint us as he always does. You're a constant disappointment. Come on! Don't go, no, 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 that guy's coming at me. Jesus Christ, that guy just ran the hell out of me. Leave me alone. Wait, stop getting lucky! I had 12 defense, you had 9 attack, you prick! Oh my god. But yes, you may be right. Maybe we just have to reset the game before the tournament actually exists. And so it's possibly a thing. I don't know. I guess we'll just take the regen for now. I'll take a crap juice. <laughs> You're so fast. God. Aha. Uh -huh. All right, Walker, come with me. That's a boy. Really? Really? From there? Really? Really? All right, if you say so. I know we don't need the Venom Pass. I... Maybe you get more XP for doing, like, the, the techniques or something. Obviously, you don't really know. But, it, I don't know. He doesn't really need the HP, so I just can't do it. Oof. Oof. Okay. We have to shoot from here. It's not gonna... It's not gonna go well. Dude, for real? You did it again? You got lucky by three again? Fuck off! God! What the hell? I don't get lucky that often. Anyway. Um... We had a chance of scoring then. Our score was, our shot was above their catch, but we were a, a bit of a distance away, so it would have dropped a little bit, but it wouldn't have been that bad. But no, this prick keeps tackling me with 9 attack versus 12 defense continuously. Because he's a cheating AI git. Yo. Go away, cheating AI shithead. Pass that. Who actually. Oh, now you're using that. Oh, you know, if you were using that before, I'd be more forgiven, but you weren't. Um, I probably should just try to pass it past him. Because that dude, uh, his block isn't as good as his attack. Plus, really? Really? What the hell are you people doing? Uh, plus our, uh, I forgot what I was going to say, but basically the stats would have, yeah, our pass was really good, so. Passing would have been much more likely to go past him. Whereas you see, this guy's got four attack, but 12 bloody blocks, so we ain't chucking anything past him. So we kind of really got to go for this break. Of course he got me. Holy shit. I feel like the guard is getting kind of lucky. I gotta be honest. Okay, he's right in front of my goal now. Completely open. He's passing because he's an idiot. Well, thank you. I appreciate your idiocy. I'll take that one. I deserve You know what? After all the bullshit, I deserve that. I deserve that. Come on. Finally, it went my way. All right. Go away. <sighs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> uh, I'm going to try and get it to um, whoever's at the back over here. And then try and bait this dude away from Walker and then pass it into Walker. I'm really trying to get Walker a freaking goal here. We actually just need to score in general, to be fair. If we need to come third place, we're going to win a match, I think. All right. Okay. Just just this one dude. I just need him to not get lucky. That's all, that's all I want. Fuck off. Though he has a special attack. We've seen that. Okay, he didn't do it. Thank you. Thank you. Appreciate it. How fucking fast are the Guanos? Oh my god. He's got 12 block? Oh my lord. Alright, you know what? Fuck it. I hate the Guanos. I hate him. Down is better than Walker. Eh. I think maybe later in the game. Maybe. Right now, Walker's better. Deserve that. You deserve that. Oh, now you're gonna get it, bitches. Now you're gonna get it. You just shut the shit out of you. Here you go. This is taking my ball every time. Did you get seeded? Uh, no. We did not. Hey! <laughs> okay. As usual, Titus is the only one that can score <laughs> out of our fucking strikers. Because we have the overpowered jet shot. Without that... Man, is this game much fucking harder? Leave me alone. I can't tackle for shit. Stop running into Titus every time. Got a 22 pass. You alright? You alright? Wow. Look at how imbalanced our levels are. I mean, to be fair, it's mostly Walker. He's so low compared to everyone else. That's the other problem. I mean, like, given that, he's, he's not he's not dreadful. He just, he's just very low level. Because, you know, we couldn't use him for half the freaking game. Because he's like, I'm retiring. And then you're like, hey, do you want to join my Blitzball team? And he's like, eh, sure, why not? 
completely forgot that he was retired. Yeah, I know, right? It's like so, um... What, is it, what do they call it? Ludonarrative dissonance. It's like... Everyone wants to kill us because we, you know, defied the church and... You know, tried to kill a maester and blah blah blah. We're playing Blitzborn in a giant fucking stadium. <laughs> that is the dumbest shit. <laughs> like, it's actually the dumbest shit. Dude, there's so many people marking Walker. How much? Look, there's like three people right next to him. The fuck, man? Look at this shit. Alright, I might be out of. Mm, maybe. Maybe we should just, like, shoot with him straight away. Can you not? Can you fucking not? Oh my god. These people. Just give me the bloody ball for once. Just start learning abilities and matches. I mean, I'm, I'm trying. It ain't that easy, man. You gotta win them. Hooray! Boo! Hooray! Alright. Walker is, like, kind of open, but at the same time, quite a slow mover. At least compared to the Guados. So he's not getting anywhere near that goal. Yeah. That's, that's the problem. I'm going to break this dude before his friend shows up. Please don't. Just don't. Thank you. Thank you. Appreciate it. Thank you. Can we not have two people on me? <gasps> we only got one. <gasps> He's only got four attack. This is my moment to shine in the sun. The spotlight's on me, boys. Take this, you bitch. First class delivery, fucko. All right. We finally scored with the ginger... Ninja. I, I was trying to think of something like Warrior that rhymed with Ginger, but there is nothing. Ninja? That's too generic. Ninja sounds better. But Minge means something else entirely, so. Uh, that's right. Don't you select the enemy, learn and choose an ability to learn before a game, then if they perform it. Oh, fuck, you might be right. I think I forgot that that was a thing. I think I completely forgot that that existed. But I think you're right, yes. Yes, I think when you mark people, you can actually choose to... Maybe we haven't unlocked that yet. Maybe you unlocked that at a certain level, because I didn't see the option to do that. But yeah, you can definitely do that at some point, if not yet. Though we might be able to do it now. I don't remember. Um, oh, that's bad. I just... Yep, yeah, he's going to take this ball. Gonna take his ball and go home. Yeah, you can, you can definitely mark people and learn abilities that they use. That's how people start learning Jet Shot from Titus. However, I don't think we're high enough to do that yet. I think you might have to be a certain level, but I'm not sure. I'm going for it. I'm going for it. I'm fucking going for it. Oh god, there's two of them on me. No! I'm gonna try and break them. Three, three, oh, no, okay. You know what, we're fucked. Like, absolutely royally fucked. Unless this guy does, like, half of his damage. No. No, he did not. I could have scored with three shot on, like, 13 catch. It could have happened. I don't think it could have happened. I don't think they can get that. 27 pass! And then you can get that unlucky. Got to follow the person with it and press triangle when they use it. Oh, really? Oh. Like, now you say that, I'm like, oh yeah, that's totally a thing, but... Apparently I can believe we got. Yeah, you're right. You have to you have to time it, don't you? But they, I don't think... Isn't it like a secret thing? I don't think they tell you, do they? Maybe they do. Maybe this is in the tutorial somewhere. Yeah, because for example, you see like where we just use that attack, like when our legs are up in the air, I think if you press it like just before he hits, like just after his legs are up in the air, then you could learn like that attack, for example. And I think it makes like a bing bong sound if you learn or something, it's like, you know, like when you when you score a goal or something. Well, not that, not that sound, but like it makes a sound effect so indicating you've learned it. He's about to score, this is bad. Yep. Oh, we might be able to take him. We maybe can take him. Okie dokie. Yeah, it was kind of close. A little too close. Try and bait him away from the goal. No, there's two of them on me. Help me. Walk and help me, you ginger prick. Uh, well, okay. We can, yeah, sure, I guess we're just going to try and pass past this dude and hope we don't get blocked. You're back. Welcome back, me. How's it going? Uh, take it, Walker. Take it like a little bitch that you are. Oh, okay. Just catch my ball. It's fine. It's fine. I didn't want it. You have it. No, get away from my goal. Get away from my goal. Keeper is not good at keeping. Okay. Here's the problem, though. He needs to, like, try to save goals to level up. 
So a good tactic is if you know an enemy has not particularly strong strikers, you can actually just let them shoot a keeper. As weird as that is. A good way of leveling them up. This is bloody perfect. This is bloody per- actually it's not perfect. But it's pretty good. Oh yeah, take it son, take it, take it you slut. Take it you dirty, filthy slut. Alright, so what we do is we break him and we hope he doesn't take me out, but he might, because he's a dick. Fantastica. And hrap! Oh, I went down. But we can still do it. Oh, he's got super goalie. Oh, great. No, it didn't go up at all. Oh, come on. Come on. He got unlucky as hell and then got... Well, he broke even, to be fair. But still. How dare you break even? <gasps> this is like the only person Tyus can tackle. My god, he's a man beast. I'm gonna spear shot this shit out of him. That sound. That's the sound it makes. That sound right there. When you learn ability. Right, we should try and work on that then. Because again, I, for some reason... Either, well, I, I did forget there was a thing. But I also thought that you just couldn't do it yet. Because uh, no one's done it to us. Like, no one's been learning, like, jack shot and how, what have you. But uh, maybe they, maybe for the AI they can't learn it into a certain level. That might be... That might be the case. I don't know. Boop. 400 gold. That's pretty cheap. I'll take it. So yeah, I think we need to throw all the games now uh, to get that regen, which is weird. It's weird. Uh, but yeah, we'll try and figure out the uh, the marking thing. Yeah, I swear they don't tell you that in the tutorial. Again, I might be wrong, but I swear they bloody don't. Alright, so... Blah, 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 same people. Lovely. Okay. So. This is the technique. Sorry, we don't care about that. Mark. Oh, you see how, uh, for example, Nap Pass is highlighted there, but Anti Nap is not. That means that Titus can learn Nap Pass from him. And I think you can mark the same person. Uh, for example, yes, we could both mark uh, mark both those. We could both mark him to learn with a whatever Magicka with a tackle, and then if you learn it, it will be like one person learns it, and then you have to like do it again. So, that is interesting. Uh, so, for example, Walker would probably want, out of all these, I guess, tackles. Yeah. And then Letty. With a tackle, I suppose. Not a lot of choice there. Uh, but what you should do strategically is, let's say, uh, a key technique for Letty is Nap Pass. You want to make sure you're only marking that dude with Letty because you don't want to learn, you know, that key technique that would be a key technique for Letty and then learn it with, like, Walker or something instead and then fuck up learning with Letty because then you might have to wait for ages to find the right opponent with the right ability because sometimes they're not going to have the ability equipped and blah, blah, blah. So, should be paying attention to what our key techniques are. However, what I think it also does is I think maybe it highlights the key techniques in a different color, but I'm not sure. I'm not sure about that one. I don't rightly know, son, to be honest. I don't rightly know. Uh, I think Wither is definitely the best one to learn, but we're, we're gonna end up like marking a lot of a lot of people marking that same dude. This guy can't learn shit, so I guess you just don't mark anyone. You useless fuck. Uh, you're probably gonna want. Uh, why does their keeper have drain tackle equipped? Who the fuck equipped these people? What are you doing, you moron? If they like, he had super goalie last time. I could have learned fucking super goalie. Like, what are you doing? It's so irritating. <laughs> just need to throw one game, and you're out a third, in my opinion. I think so. I think so. But yeah, either way, this is the game we have to throw. So what we want to do is we want to actually encourage them to... Hopefully, A, take shots at Keeper, but not score. So that we can... Uh, you know... Stuff. So that we can uh, get ESP on Keeper. And we want to have them use their tackles and things so that we can learn them. But again, I don't know how I'm going to get this timing down. I'm going to just have to kind of like break people and then hug. I pressed it. Oh, it's triangle you said. Son of a bitch. I pressed the wrong button. But yeah, it's basically it. Let's try it again. Hack me again. I didn't press. I didn't press triangle. Is it definitely triangle, or is it like square or something? I need to look this up, so I'm not pressing the wrong button. Because I tried crossing, I tried triangle, but it, I thought it made like a... Dudder, like, you know, that sort of buzzer sound when you do it wrong. Uh, button to learn technique. 
in Blitzball when marking opponents. Yeah. Tech copying, yes. That. Blah, 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 blah. When tech copy flashes blue and white, you must press the cross button when it's flashing white. Otherwise, your tech copy will not be successful. However, different techniques have different timing. Uh, so it is cross, it's not triangle. So I was right the first time, it is cross. Uh, good to know. It's probably just you, but the screen is glitching. What do you mean? Uh, I don't think it has to be that specific person, right? Because it's just whoever's marking them, is it not? Because isn't that the point of marking them? I don't think it matters who they use it against. I think it's just as long as you have them marked. Oh, see, this is this is potentially good. You useless sack of shit. That would have been a good time for him to get some EXP there by saving a goal that was actually less powerful than his catch. But he's keeper, so he's a useless sack of shit. So he fucked it up. It's all pixelated. Uh, try refreshing the stream? It should be fine. Uh, damn it! All right, who's got who's got with the tackle? Isn't it with the tackle one, not with the tackle two? This guy's got with the tackle. That's really powerful. So when it was like flashing, I haven't seen anything flashing. Yeah, he's using with the tackle two. So we haven't. I'm confused. Yeah, you're right. It's like text or something. I think he's on the loft, top left. Oh, good. Uh, these are in like the top left corner or something like that, where the text comes up, and you're right, it, it, yeah, hmm. No one's actually used anything that we can learn yet, basically. Which is uh, a little annoying. Hey, Take that, you slut. Which one of you has bloody wither tackle? One of you shits must. What about nap tackle? Ah, he said tech copy. Okay, I did too early, but good to know. Good to know. We're learning, people. We're learning. Or at least we're remembering, because I definitely knew this, but apparently completely forgot it was a mechanic. Because I'm pretty sure it wasn't in the tutorial. Which is kind of weird. Take that! Uh, what are you doing? You have one shot. What are you doing? I mean, if you want to take a shot at my goalie, be my guest. My, my, my defender is asleep. Of course, of course you're part- oh my god, look at them. They're like, swarming on us, man. Yeah, this is like, the guy I didn't want to take a shot at Keeper. Come on, Keeper. Oh, come on, son! He actually, he actually got lucky there. Keeper did, but he's, he still missed it by one. God, I hate him. I hate him so- he, he becomes like the best goalie in the game, but he's bloody awful for so long. Like, I feel like a disappointed parent just watching my child fall off their bike again and again and again. Like, fucking hell. Come on, you fat bastard. I didn't raise you like this. Alright, anyway. You know, I thought you were the nap tackle, bitch. You was nap tackle was all you you goddamn filthy owlbed scum. No offense, Rico. Hit me! I need that so you can tackle me. What? How did I not get it? I feel abused. Will actually abused. I'd like to point out, we haven't lost a match yet that we didn't intentionally throw. I'd like you to, to realize that. This is potentially good. Keeper might finally save a goal. It's way less, Keeper. Come on, son. Thank you. Finally some bloody XP for this fat sack of shit. Alright. Now tackle me. Please. Any of... I don't... Not you. You have with the tackle too, sir. He didn't even use it. He, did, he didn't even need to use it. He's a god. He's a god of my Ming with stupid hair. Hey, shoot a keeper. Come on. Oh, that's my boy! It's like they're trying to level him up. The rest are kind of leveling themselves up, which is kind of annoying. Yeah! Look at him go! What a champ. You have to give him encouragement when he's doing well. Can't always call him a fat sack of shit, even though we all know that's what he is. Uh, break. I must break you. Oh. Wait, what? His level's too low? What? So I did it right, but his level's too- Fucking hell. Oh my god. Walker. What are you doing, son? So apparently you can't tech copy if your level is too low. Below them. Oh, so you learn something new every day, don't you? Learn something new every day. 
I'm trying to break you. Maybe I'm gonna shoot. Cause F it. Aha! Uh -huh. Right, give me my goddamn regen. I worked hard for that, and then threw really hard for that. Okie dokie, Alex. Three dreams, buddy. How much XP do you keep? Keep got ten. He's down level up. Exciting. Is he gonna get? Ca he got a catch. What a guy. Bum ba da dum. All right. Let's see if we can fix this marking sitch. Uh, didn't like anything. So, all right. So, grip gloves. That is a goalie technique, I believe. Actually, is it a goalie technique? I think it is. I think, I think it is. Hang on. Can you learn grip gloves? No, it's not a goalie technique then. Uh, keep it can learn nothing. Good, good, exciting. You can learn grip gloves, which is something. Uh, Jess, you can learn with the tackle. Who are we learning with the tackle from? Lacan. Who's a defender? Okay, so. Lacan is the one, primarily. Yeah, Lacan's gonna be the one primarily that we want to let attack us. So we can learn with attack. Because with, with attack is probably the best attack. Because if it works, it will half the stat of one of their stats. So if you wither tackle a striker and you happen to wither their shoot, you know, their shot, you'll say they have 20 shot, they go down to 10. It's it's broken as hell. Uh, Lacam is the person we're looking for. I can't remember what Lacam is. I think Lacam's sort of up over here-ish. I think it's this bitch right next to Walker. I think it's you, right? Are you Lacam? No, you're Edgar. I know it's not his name, but he's Edgar to me, damn it. It's like when, uh, you know, people can't pronounce, like, Mexican food. Like, I'll have a, a queso. Uh, a quesalilla. Like, it's a quesadilla, motherfucker. Uh, wait, where the hell's Lacam? Oh, Lacam's on the other end, the bloody... Okay, so she's by Titus, alright. Good to know. I think it's a she. I don't remember who Lacam is. Let's be honest here. I have no idea. Stop it. Him. Really? That was dreadful. You should have taken them straight out. Say it easy, Eric. Hope work goes well. This is Blapper. <laughs> you have the stupidest name. Uh, okay. It's probably gonna score. You never know. Keep him might pull it out of the bag, but I really doubt it. Though he's shooting from quite a ways away. No, he's also passing. Well, never mind that. Just give the ball to Lackham. In fact, no, give the ball to me so I can get tackled by Lackham. Give me the damn ball. Fucko. I'm going to actually let him shoot. I'm going to intentionally not tackle him as hard as we can. Because I want... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Keep it to get his feet. It's also possible he might fuck it up, but, you know. Got to give him a chance to fail. Good job there, buddy. You're welcome. Alright, so where's Lackham at, yo? You're not Lackham, I don't think. Who are you? You're Blapper. Go away, Blapper. Lackham, come to me. Lackham! You Lackham? Frickin' finally, okay. Do it. I'm gonna fuck up the timing now. She didn't even use it! You bitch! Oh my god, that's toting as hell. She didn't even use it, she just insulted me. She's like, I don't need to use that. That's my ball anyway. And then she's just... beating up my goal. Lackham, you're an asshole. I will learn a stand technique. Oh, I will. Uh, with the... You know what? I'm okay with that. It's very unlikely we're going to block it, but it's also very likely we're going to block it enough that Keeper can save it. Yeah, there you go. Easy goal for you, Keeper. You're welcome. Damn, Keeper's going to level up like a champ. Seem to work on Walker. Walker is still dread. Oh, hey, look who it is. Uh, where's Lacan? No! I want Lacan. <laughs> Go away. Uh, break these two. Yeah, that's never gonna work. Never gonna work. <sighs> Come on, with attack on me. Yeah, I'm fucking low down the greatest! Alright, we learned with a tackle. It was not all for naught. <laughs> Titus learned that, by the way, in case you missed that. Well, I think we marked it with two people, so we kinda wanna do it again if we get a chance. 
but I'll take it. I'll take it. We learned a technique. We actually did it. I am the greatest. The other mean one, Mr. Grinch. Really? I mean, to be fair, he was lower. Oh dear. They're right in front of my goal. Don't stop passing all around the bloody pitch field thing. Rink. Whatever. I don't know what you'd call it. The, the water bowl. The bowl of water. Give it back to Lackam. I want with attack. Oh my god. Perfect. Actually, maybe we can shoot. Well, no, we shouldn't. Why? Well, no, we should. Well, we're not going to work. Uh, let's try anyway. Fuck it. <sighs> okay. Easy goal. No? Okay, maybe not. Is that like him? That's Judder. Judder, give it to give it to my team so I can go. Just just give it. To, just be Lackham, basically. Just be Lackham. Why can't you be Lackham? Why can't you be more like your sister? Really? That was awful. That was even worse. You did one damage? One? Jeez. Christ, I can see why you're not on offense. I mean defense. Ooh, I learned that shot as well, I'm the greatest. Keeper saved it with his fat thing. Okay, I don't know how you actually wake people up, to be honest with you. Oh, we're not gonna get time. No, wait, maybe, maybe we'll get time. No, we're not gonna get time. Oh, lame. 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 I thought we could just about get there in time to get Lackham to attack on me, but no. Damn. But we learned two techniques. And we did throw the match like we were supposed to. It's a fix. Okay, he's not that far. Oh, Walker, uh, Walker, uh, Walker leveled up as well. Uh, he got shot. Sweet. And Jasu got blocked, which is okay. And Keeper is close to leveling up again. Alright, this is actually going fairly well. Black Amp, yeah, fuck you, Black Amp. Alright, do I, do I get third place now? Because I lost. Oh. I did, 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 did I win? Did I lose? What's going on? I don't know what's going on. I guess I'm gonna save. Uh, it's possible we have to play more matches, but I don't know. What position are we in in the tournament? I have no clue. Uh, championship match, Runs of Fangs versus the Arbus. Uh, Constellation match, Killer Beast versus Poseidon Orcs. We're in the Constellation match. Is that for third, third place? It is, right? It's gotta be if it's the Constellation match. Right? Right? Am I right? I think I'm right. I guess we'll see. I honestly don't know. Um, We did unlock... I think it was Napshot for Walker, which is probably gonna be better than uh, the Poison. We got Wither Tackle and Titus, but he does have Jet Shot and Spish Shot at the moment. I think you end up with like five or six slots by the time they sort of makes out. It's third and fourth place playoff, so you need to win it. Okay. Got it in the bag, don't you worry. Um, I should maybe give Titus uh, with his angle instead of this. Because as we've seen, Titus is fucking dreadful at taking the ball off of anyone. And if we could just make that even a little bit better, you know, maybe. Maybe it will help. This guy's already got three slots for techniques and has one technique. What a guy. Uh, I can't remember what else we learned. We learned something. Stimulate poison effects. Makes you immune to poison, I think. Uh, was it Keeper that learned something? Oh, wait, no, no, no. It was it was Walker and Tyson. Yeah, we equipped them both. Okay, okay. Okay. Bully shot. That sounds pretty good. Ixon has sphere shot. Oh, Jesus. Okay. Screen tackle with a pass. Same tag of grip gloves, body shot, blah 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 blah. I still see grip gloves is a goalie technique. I'm sure it is. But for some reason keeper can't learn it. What happens is, if I recall, is when you learn the the key techniques for people, you then unlock the ability to learn a wider variety of stuff. So for example, he might be able to learn grip gloves after he gets his key techniques. It sort of opens them up and makes them less shit. That's what Wither Tackle 3! Are you kidding me? That's insane, that guy's gonna do fucking crazy damage. What's his tackle normally? 12. That's gonna put it up to like 20 plus. That's nuts. Uh, who are we marking on right now? Is this Walker? I, I think it's Walker. 
No, it was Titus. Yeah, Volley Shot probably the only one. Uh, we learned Spear Shot with Walker. That would be pretty sweet. Let's try and do that. We don't really want him to Spear Shot at us, but... If we get up enough goals, it might be worth risking it, right? It might be worth risking it. Hmm. All of the things. Rip gloves, I suppose. And you probably can't learn very much. No, not bloody thing. Again, he's bloody useless. Even at learning things until he levels up. This is going to be our last match of the stream, by the way. I do need to pee desperately, so I'll be right back. Okay. I'm back. I don't remember who the hell we marked him for what. I think, if I recall, Spear Shot is uh, quite a pain in the ass to learn because you have to use it, or you have to click it, like, really late. And again, it's hard to get them to use it and blah blah blah. Hey, this is the guy with it, I think? Who was him? Was it? No, it's not him. No, no, no. I can't remember his name. Uh, sure. Don't know why you're shooting from there. I hope we don't catch this, but we probably will. Oh, okay. Works for me. Again, free XP for a keeper. And he fumbled it. Nice. Nice. Swish. Well done. Alright, so who... Uh, again, we've got to make sure we win this. Oh god, i got three people on me. That's bad. I'm going to try and break them all. We might learn uh, a tackle or something out of this, at least. Oof. Oh, we didn't learn shit. But hey, uh, you can see why these guys are in the Constellation match, can't you? Right. He's dribbling. How did you do so little damage? Yeah. Okay, we need to not fuck around here. We need to make sure we get up. Get up a, get up a point. There we go. Alright, Walker, go ahead, son. I gotta level your bitch ass up. Yo. Get out of here. What? You've got 12? Okay, that's bad. Oh, oh, good. Yeah, I can't learn that on anyone right now. Yep, that's, uh... Holy shit, she's so quick. Ooh. That character... She's... She's dangerous. I'm telling you now. That fast and having with the tackle three already? Dangerous. That's bad. She might be the only good player on that team. And correct me if I'm wrong, but she clearly wasn't originally a Killica Beast. I think they signed her, doesn't she? Yeah, she's out of bed. She's clearly out of bed. Yeah, she's fast as fuck, boy. Dude, that's ridiculous. What the hell? <laughs> she's got so much block and attack. Holy shit. Yeah. She's just, like, she's just great at getting the ball. Um, I mean, we should have her here, but still. She ends up encountering us again. Uh, it's gonna be a little difficult. Okay, we're out of her range. What? Oh fucking hell! All right, so there is an ability that allows you to attack people from way bigger radius as well. So she's got that too. Jesus Christ, dude! This person don't fuck around. This person does not fuck around. Come on! I'm gonna just fight her the entire time. I need- I actually kind of need her to pass the ball, because I can't get the ball from her, at least I can't keep it. Oh, Go, go, go. Dude, she tackles from so far away. 
Oh my god. I'm just hoping I get lucky and the ball sells over her head. And she doesn't touch it. Yeah, she keeps getting it. She's got to level up as well doing this continuously. That's the thing as well. We just got to power level her. It's, it's almost tempting to sign her in one of our like extra slots and just not use her. Just so no one else can have her. That's why I have brother. I, I'm not sure if anyone else can sign brother, but I feel like maybe they can. And who was the other guy? I guess, yeah, I guess we got Dado and... Actually, we should let we should let Dado go so people can level up. And then if he becomes good, we can just rehire him when the, when his contract ends. No, this bitch, I can't get away from... Oh, wait, it's not even her. This, she's back! Oh my god, dude. What the shit? She gets the ball every time. It's ridiculous. She's so fast as well. Look, she's out running like three of my team. She she's taking the piss now. She's actually taking the piss out of us. What the hell? Uh, I, d I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. I I I'm just like per I'm permanently trapped with this woman. I can't. <laughs> oh no. Oh my god. <laughs> Is she gonna sh- oh, okay, she's passing. Holy shit, dude. Yo, please just don't give it to her. Please. It's all I want. Okay. Uh, oh no, because I'm gonna tackle him and I'm gonna be right in her radius again. Are you kidding me, man? <laughs> I can't get away. I'm just stuck. Oh no. Oh my god, I give up. I, d I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do against this bitch. Dude, I can't get it to Titus. I can't get the ball away. I get it off her, she gets it back. She's like taking the piss as well, just shooting. Okay, please. Oh no, why do you keep grabbing it? You're right next to her. No. <laughs> no. <laughs> I can't. I can't be it. I just have to hope that this cell is over her head. That's all I can do. Every time, dude. Holy shit. <laughs> this woman's crazy. We have to hire her when we can, just so no one else can have her. She's like the greatest midfielder I have ever seen. It is ridiculous. She's quick as fuck. You can tackle her, but she gets the ball right back every time. It's insane. And she actually has, even then, actually has pretty decent defense. That was that was the most ridiculous half of this one thing I've ever seen. Elite defense. Bet you do. Uh, she's got she's got super goalie. But here's the annoying thing: is as you may have noticed, they have to use the ability for me to learn it. One of Keeper's key techniques that he needs to learn is super goalie. She's not a goalie. She's not going to use it, because she's not in the goal mouth. So even though she's got it equipped, it doesn't mean shit. We can't learn it, she's going to use it. It's really irritating. It's, it's really irritating. She's also got anti-wither. And anti-wither too. Okay. Uh, this character is actually nuts. They're like a fucking tank. She's insane. 72 speed! Dude, our fastest guy is like 62. Look, 60, 60, 60, 72, 60, 57. Oh, so why is she level 12? What the fuck, dude? <laughs> what is going on? <laughs> I don't know how to compete with this woman. She's like shutting my team down the entire time. Holy shit, I think I saved before this, didn't I? Oh, nice little marker, I guess. I think I saved before this. Uh, I I think we're gonna end up like what? No, it's a tournament, isn't it? Doesn't someone have to have to score? Like someone has to win? We have to like if we can get away from her, we're good. As soon as she's near us, we're fucked. Like we just just like a constant cycle of just her getting the ball, me getting the ball back, her getting the ball back, endless. He's shooting. I mean, you know, each to their own, I guess. Walker, really? Jesus Christ, dude. You fumbled that? It had zero shot. My team are awful. Like, actually just fucking dreadful. Apart from Titus. And to a degree, Walker. 
It's just like a shit show of just dreadful, dreadful Blitzball players. I mean, again, this was the whole gimmick of the Besaid Orox, is they, they hadn't won a match until we won a match. Uh, I'm gonna kind of have to go with Titus and just, like, get a jet shot off, because, man, she will probably encounter me from there. Oh, yes, she will. Look at the fucking speed of that woman. <gasps> okay. We can just get this in. The goalie has, like, no catch. This should be elementary, but I kind of doubt it. This is insane. I can't believe how good she is. Oh, fucking hell. I wasn't ready for the tech copy. God damn it. What did he have? Grip gloves, maybe? Oh, shit, that's annoying. I was not ready for that at all. Hey, we scored, though. That's something. Uh, okay, with a pass. I'm not gonna... Well... I'm gonna try. Of course. Maybe you should just let him with a pass. There are four people. Uh. <laughs> oh, look who it is. Is it... It must be by speed... No, I think it's by, like, offense. Like, who you break first. Yeah, it is. 13, 11, 8, 5. Hmm. It says crazy block. Okay, so if we can break her and then... Honestly, maybe we could just shoot it past the rest of these people. But yeah, we have jet shot, I guess. So we don't have to get past one. I'm just trying to make sure we... Just make sure we win. Because I don't trust this bitch not to be a difference maker. Like, statistically speaking, if we can just never really keep the ball away from her a bit... Oh, god damn it, I did it again. I didn't... I had my hands behind my head. If we can just never keep the ball away from her, she's eventually gonna, by the law of averages, somehow get it in the freaking goal. Either her or, like, get it to someone who can. Just, like, bait all our team. See what I mean? Just bait all our team down somewhere so the goal's open. Exactly what she's doing right now. So if there was a, a striker over there, she could pass it in. Easy goal. She didn't, because the strike is nowhere near the goal. But theoretically, she's great for team balance. She could be, she could be what they need to not suck anymore. Oh god. Um. Okay, we should be able to take this. With it. Oh, is this a guy with anti with her? I don't think so. I can't remember who has that. Fucking hell, man. I right, break you. I don't know. I guess. I guess shoot. I suppose. We may. Wait a minute. What happened to my goddamn ball? I thought I did another jet shot. Did it not go in? I wasn't paying attention. I didn't realize he saved it. Holy shit. Every time I actually have my fucking hand on the thing, that's like, it's so quick. I need to be ready for that. I think we can get that. Well, no, I guess we could get another chance if I go there and just try and shoot really quick. That might be worth it, actually, just sort of shooting from, like, anywhere to try and get that to activate. Oh, good. It's Titus again. Ah, oh, great. Goldfish, indeed. <gasps> Hooray! It comes up so quick as well. He's doing a spear shot? Fuck yeah. Except he's breaking two people, so he's not going to get to do it. Unless this guy gets unlucky. Please get unlucky. I want a spear shot. Did I even mark him for spear shot? I don't think I did. No, I did. Oh, I did it too early. Yeah, the timing's really hard on that one. Hey, good job. Anyway, we can learn grip gloves anytime, or whatever the hell that technique is. I don't think it's that big of a deal. I must break you. Hey, All right, so we learned the technique equal two there. We won the match, so we should get regen. Hopefully someone on our team can learn it, because to be honest, maybe no one can. I don't really know. It's hard to tell. Hey, let's level up. I've got a bunch of shit. Fire that bitch who kept, like, putting up the fight. I forget her name. Nida or something. Oh, we didn't get top score. Well, we got joint top score, I guess.
shit, no one can learn regen. After all of that, I threw the tournament for regen and no one could learn it. But hey, we had to play the tournament anyway, so. And the other two, I guess the Alexia, was there an Alexia? Was it like a soft and, a, I don't remember, it was like a soft and something else. Uh, either way, it was crap, crap rewards. Anyway, so let's go to today's stream. Thank you for joining me. I do hope you enjoyed it. Uh, I had fun. Don't about you. Oh, God. I keep forgetting this thing. I hate it. I hate it so much. So thank you especially uh, to this month's patrons who are... On a momento, por favor. I have to open this every time. I need to remember to open this before the stream. But as you've seen, my memory is that of a goldfish. Hence forgetting that that man had grip gloves like three times. <laughs> okay. So thank you very much to Miss Justice 83 Dr. Papa Penguin, Rohan Dani, Billy Nine, Shadow Sephiroth 666, Jeremy Burris, Philip Rep, Luna Parker, Vincent Clark, Few Knight, George Blackwell, Black Wolf 8994, Ixa, Hitbox, Nero, Age, and Pedro Marquez. Thank you, everybody. Thank you for stopping by. Do hope you enjoyed the stream. We'll probably be streaming tomorrow. I'll do my best. Uh, yeah. Uh, at some point this week, probably, I do want to get back to Red Dead 2 because, you know, I keep hearing things about the story and I'm like, oh, that sounds really cool. And we haven't got to any of the cool stuff in the story yet, so. I want to give that game a bit more of a chance, you know, like, uh, I've kind of expressed how I feel about the gameplay when it comes to Red Dead, the gameplay is sorely lacking, but in terms of, like, everything else, I think the game's pretty fucking fantastic, so, for that, and the fact that I want to see the story unfold, as I've heard little bits about how cool it gets, I'm like, yeah, we need to get back to Red Dead, so at some point this week, or soon, we're going to get back to Red Dead, but obviously we'll still be doing Final Fantasy X. anyway, good night everybody, and goodbye.